audio check. Quick check. One more quick check. Quick check. Good morning, good afternoon, 
Hope everyone's doing well today. <laughs> um, I did try to set up, because I qualified for affiliate, I think, on the um, Saturday. So I set everything up on like Saturday morning, Saturday afternoon. So ads are there, because, you know, I got to make money. Anyway, <laughs> um, this is my first stream as an affiliate, which is kind of cool, kind of poggers, you know. Um, it took a bit to get here, but I made it. My goal was to hit it by February, which thankfully we hit. So, <laughs> cancel. <laughs> Y'all gonna have to see ads. I'm sorry. Like, just get a Twitch Turbo subscription and then you're set. Or you can sub to me. I don't know. Pick one. Um, <laughs> yeah. So, plan is simple for today. As promised, I will be deleting my Animal Crossing Island after I do... Um, a quick tour of it because you know I will be sad. I have tissues on standby if needed. And then later, a short Mario Kart challenge where I might be gifting subs. We'll see. We'll, we'll talk about that later. I don't want to bait people too early. Um, and then near the end, we're going to be talking <laughs> about. I'm not going to look at you guys. Going to be talking about like what type of emotes like chat or like I would like to have for the channel because. Ultimately, what I want is I want subs to, like, have no ads, because that's cool, because ads suck to an extent, but, you know, gotta make money. And also, I want emotes to be, like, the main reason why you subscribe, because I think emotes is so pivotal to just chat culture in general. So I kind of want to have a discussion about that later, but that's near the end. Plan is to maybe go for maybe two and a half, three hours today. I don't know how long I actually want to play... Uh, Animal Crossing for because I just want to delete and maybe set up a little bit of the island and then I head to the Mario Kart Challenge. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for coming in. Very rainy and Katie, I appreciate and love you guys so much. You guys have made the past few streams great because like, you guys are always engaged and like typing chat up, so I appreciate you guys. Thank you. Um, so let's go ahead and kill our villagers. <laughs> okay, so let's start our game. Also change our category. <clears throat> I'm also going to be changing the title of the stream throughout the day. That way the title... I don't want to bait first affiliate all day long, you know what I mean? Let's see. Um, put at the top. How do you spell deleting? Oh, <laughs> oh, frick! I put in, <laughs> I put D E L E I, <laughs> deleting. Oh, I still did it. Oh, the title's so long. My God. Oh, I, there's a, there's a, is there a character limited titles? No, there's not. Okay. <laughs> okay, I need to, I, I still spelled the leading wrong. I gotta fix that. There we go. Mods? Okay. There we go. Alright, yeah, we're gonna get there. We're gonna say bye. <clears throat> okay. Our audio level's good. Is the game too loud? I kind of like when the game is, like, at the same volume I'm at. I think it's good. If it's, if it's like, needs to be fixed, tell me. Okay, guys? Um, I haven't touched Animal Crossing in about a month. I logged in last night just to make sure, like, audio was good, but I haven't, like, played the game in a bit. Um, okay. <laughs> Later, losers. Okay, bye, Katie. <laughs> um, morning, everyone. Right now on Tiblin. Oh, I named my island Tiblin because I just wanted, like, a cutesy name. Like, it's totally random, but that's what it is. Hi, Rosalina. Thank you for coming in. Yeah, we're gonna delete the island. We're gonna kill everyone. <laughs> kill all our villagers. And then start a new one. Which I honestly wanted to do for a while, but, you know, I wanted to bait people for stream. Because I promised once I hit um, affiliate, I would be deleting her. So, Okay, it's 11.09 on Monday, January 24th. I don't have any big news to share with, all <laughs> with you all today, but I would like to touch on one seasonal topic. Ah, another one of those days that chills you right to the core. Which means it's also a perfect day to go outside and play in the snow. <laughs> hey guys. 
Um, if you do venture out into the cold, check the ground for snowballs and give them a little push. Keep rolling them up, and once they get big enough, you can stick two together to make a snowboy. I hope to see a whole parade of snowboys on my morning walk eventually. And with that, I'll get back to work supporting you and your enjoyment of our island. I love her little announcements. Oh my god. They're so cute. <laughs> so cute. No, we're not killing chat. We're killing the villagers on the island. <laughs> okay. Um... So we can do, like, a quick little tour and, like, say goodbye to all of our villagers. Let's talk to Molly. Molly, she's, like, cute, but she has, like, no character. <clears throat> um, you haven't been around in a while, Lollipop. Oh my gosh, she calls me Lollipop, which is so cute. We haven't even spoken in, uh, two months? Can that be right? Probably. I don't like not knowing what's going on with you, so let's try to see more of each other, okay? <laughs> Kelpium, I'm gonna delete you guys. I'm gonna kill everyone. Okay, we need to talk to Aurora because she is my wife. She is my queen. I adore her. Beyond explanation. Like, I love her so much. I have two Aurora photographs. She gave me two of them because she loves me so much. Hey, hi there. So... <laughs> I can really use some company right now if you're not busy. Would you be out for a quick visit over at my place? She calls me baby too. And it's like, that's when I knew she was the one, okay? Baby is my favorite, like, pet name. So keep in mind, chat, when you become parasocial Andes, okay? <clears throat> sure, right, we can hang out with Aurora one last time. Oh no. <sighs> this feels bad. This feels bad, man. Oh my god, I love her so much. <clears throat> My place is a bit cozy, but I hope you'll be comfortable. Uh, uh. My god, this does not feel good. <laughs> I think it's funny when you give the villagers, like, bugs or fish and they just keep them in their house. It it's so funny. Oh my god, look how happy she is. He's so happy to see me. Oh no. Okay, let, let, let's have our final words with Aurora. I made sure everything was just right before you got here. Oh my god, she's so cute. She's literally me. She's actually just a printed copy of me, like my whole character. Oh. <laughs> How would you feel about playing a fun little game I know? Sure, we can play games. Let's play high card, low card. Oh, I haven't played this. I'm pretty good at ex I'm pretty good at explaining the rules of this game. Would you like to hear them? She she's not dead yet. Okay, she's we're not there yet. We don't want to kill her off just yet. Um, I think the rules are pretty ex self explanatory. Ooh, box shirt uniform. She's just our local musician. Okay, first card is seven. Okay, if we talk about math, probability, and the odds, there are 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Five cards that are higher, and then six cards that are... Nope. Does ace count as lower or higher? Question. So at least six cards that are lower. So, odds are very close. They are very <laughs> close to each other. So, honestly, it could be a toss-up. Let's go lower, because, you know, even if it's by one, odds are still higher. Fuck me. Aw, oh, man. I did not have fun. Math was not fun. <clears throat> what? Okay, why do you think Aurora calls me daddy? She calls me baby, okay? <laughs> Oh, me. I literally don't dust the house at all. Like, that was one of my childhood chores growing up, and I hated it. But I would just dust the areas that people would always see. Oh my god, I love how her house looks like a kindergarten classroom. With, like, the soft wood, the bright colors. I'm gonna miss this place. 
Okay, let's go talk to everyone else. Oh! <laughs> Leaving already? I guess. Oh my god, is she gonna give me another present? A goodbye gift? Still cupcakes? <laughs> oh my god, I will think of you, Aurora. I love her so much. I'm gonna die. <clears throat> Uh, you can tell I'm anxious because I'm playing with my little tassels on my shirt. Okay. All the other villagers, I have no connection to, so I'm just like, they're there. I don't care about them, so they can just die. <laughs> Swim training? You live on the island, dude. Okay, so quick little tour. Um, I wanted to prep my island to make it pretty for stream, but <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> um... If you look at the mini-map, you can see that I have, like, OCD brain. You can- wait, actually. I have this thing to where I can draw on screen. So, if you look here... I'm using my mouse, it looks horrible. You can see that all my houses are in a row. Because I- I love the islands where there's, like, different terrain and stuff. But it's so easy to get lost. So all the houses are just in a straight row all the way across. And that's my sister's house. I mainly just added her account so I could use her house for storage before they updated it. Like all the houses are just in like a long ass row. And I wanted to put my house at like, oh, up here. I'm, I'm not thinking of what I'm saying little art piece here aesthetic and then up here i have my farmland so i got pumpkins over here to the right i had such oh my god this took forever because see how like the colors are alternating it's so satisfying to look at but it took ages ages to plant them all like i spent a solid like three hours on it one day replanting everything the pumpkin patch and then over here my other like vegetable field Oh, look at that. Look how perfect it is. It's so nice to look at. <laughs> okay, we're not gonna harvest them because we're literally gonna delete it. And then up here at the highest level, I have my orchards. And I also alternated the apple and the peach trees. I was not able to get the other... There's oranges and then... There's another type of tree. I didn't have any, like, online friends, so... I didn't get the other trees. <laughs> Rip. But if you can't tell, I like patterns a lot. I love tile patterns. Like, just stuff that is repeating. I just thought this whole, like, three-tier thing was really pretty and cool. <laughs> Ready for murder. Why do you guys- Okay, I'm giving a nice tour of my island, and you guys are just so excited for me to kill them all. Okay. So, if you look at the mini-map, I have like my town area in the bottom section because I kind of wanted a theme for my island to be like a rural suburban area I guess. So over here I have the museum. I also have a lot of benches for people to sit at. I also noticed I have a lot of dining areas. <laughs> like this is supposed to be like a little picnic-y date area with the radio and then the mic for like a private serenade. <clears throat> and then I have my rose garden I was not able to get gold roses rip, rip me and then I couldn't figure out how to place the little what are they called? droid things? I know that's not what they're called but I just thought it was cool to line them all up like this shot looks so cool the trees in the background okay and then I have like a more upscaling. <laughs> so you can see I didn't finish it because I had to order more chairs. Like I have a little upscale dining area. And it's cool because I spaced everything out to where if I had like online, everyone could have an instrument to play. 
It took forever to figure out the spacing for this. Wait, there we go. Yeah, so I'm able to play every instrument. I love the update to where you, like, you can squeeze between furniture. That was such a good update. Um, I didn't really know how to decorate my beach, so <laughs> I <laughs> I have I'm such a hoarder. Um, uh, I just have all my fish bait sitting on the ground just in case I want to fish. It's here. Like I hate having to go to my inventory and pulling stuff out and putting it back in. I don't know why this is here. Maybe to like scare the other fish away. Anyway, oh th this one can pick this up. Not that it matters, because we're literally deleting this in like 10 minutes. Oh, and then over here, by the city hall, I have like a pavilion. I just think that- I love symmetry and patterns a lot, that's why you'll see... I'm not very creative. <laughs> um... Also, I checked the news board yesterday, and it says Aurora's birthday is literally in three days, so we're gonna kill her off. I have- I have a joke, don't cancel me. But it's like, we're gonna kill her off right before her birthday, like Betty- like- <laughs> Like what we did to Betty White, I don't know. I could've delivered that better, I need to workshop that joke a bit. I thought of that bit last night, but I didn't want to say it, cause like, it's a bit like- <laughs> You know? Um, I have a zen garden. It took me ages to grind the stone to craft everything. Memories, yeah, memories, okay. <laughs> um... And then this area, I didn't finish decorating, but for lore, we're gonna say it was the abandoned carnival. So this whole section was just unfinished, like the old rusty playground and then the abandoned carnival is what we'll call it. Um, then we got the shop. I think how I decorated was kind of interesting because behind it, I have like a little break area for like people to go out and smoke when they're on break. I don't know. I thought it was cool. I didn't get any of like the custom decorations or like the tiles or patterns. Cause like, I just find that all overwhelming. Um, I have a little outdoor kitchen for like all the trendy people, you know. Got coffee. And then we got smoothies. I wish I could customize these stands to be different colors, but unfortunately you're not able to. Um, then I got the glow shop. I, I had no idea how to decorate it, so I just put my favorite, like, dresses and stuff outside of it. Okay, and that's it, basically. I think my favorite detail because if you noticed when I don't have any like lakes or what you call it. <clears throat> hey, thank you for the follow, Robust. <laughs> I appreciate it, man. Robust nugs. <laughs> um along the border I have like a forest. So I have like evergreen trees and then darker flowers. So, I have like a moat. Found you on- found me on Twitter? No shot! That's cool. Welcome to chat, man. Um, anyway, I have a moat around like, the three tiered levels. <gasps> oh my god, he's actually in town? I hate the museum so much. Like, having to- like, how you can't get all the art pieces at once, it's so annoying. Anyway, so I have park benches every few feet because I think it, park benches are very important for infrastructure. Um, and like along this whole path I made the water or I made the trench like big enough for fish to spawn so <laughs> I have a I have a bidet here because I was gonna place another bench here but I ran out of benches pronouns are they sheep got it do you have a preferred name or is, are you okay with if I call you robust up to you it's just easier for like me and chat to know um, I was gonna put, like, statues along here, too, but I ran out of statues. <clears throat> um, yeah, it's cool, because you can see, like, the tiers of the waterfall as you're going around the moat. 
I just think it's so satisfying. I love symmetry so much. It's not good design, but I like it a lot. Um, the last touch I have for like this border is as the flowers go from black, it transitions like a rainbow. Oh my god, it looks so cool. I love it so much. It took me a while to like get all the flowers, all the different colors. Hey, hi Downs! Thank you for coming into chat and yeah. Took me a bit, but you know, we got we finally got affiliate. We got there. Um Yeah, so that's my island. I was mainly focused on like just building it up because I'm not too big into decorating in general. So I was like lost on how to decorate. I only really started decorating it maybe <clears throat> what you call it. Because I was just grinding, like fishing, gaining money every day, but then I only started decorating maybe three months ago. Okay, so that's the island. Um Hey! Thank you for the sub downs. I appreciate it, man. Let's go! You're my first sub. Um, thank you, man. I wasn't gonna say. One thing I wanted to look at before we kill everyone is... <laughs> first, yeah, first. <laughs> look at, like, the letters Aurora gave me. Because I think I saved most of the letters she gave me. <laughs> look at all these unopened packages. Oh my god, because her letters are so sweet. Um, between us. Recently, I spotted an envelope on the ground. I thought there might have been a love letter inside, but it wasn't addressed to or from anyone. I peeked inside and the envelope turned out to be empty. <laughs> That's because I never wrote the letter. <laughs> okay, there was one really cute one that I have to find. You can tell I don't open my mail. <laughs> I think I sent her a letter too. I'll have to see uh, if it saves it anywhere. Ah! Oh, thank you for the lurk, Robust. Um, appreciate you staying in chat. I was out on the beach and just now remembered a funny thing you once said, and it made me smile all over again. Oh my god, I, I'm in love with Aurora. I need to. Uh, what you call it? The thing where you can buy the card and it makes the character spawn, whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called. I'm gonna miss her so much. <laughs> Look, literally, I only saved letters from her. <laughs> oh, it's the same envelope letter. Let's see. Ah! I was thinking of you, and I guess I'm writing to ask if we can plan to do something together soon. Oh my god, just marry me. I love Aurora. Oh my god. I could talk about her all day, honestly. <gasps> okay, th this line right here. We could take our friendship to the next level if we had a shared interest. Oh my god, see? She's into me. <clears throat> yeah, I think that was the letter that hit the hardest. Okay, I didn't really decorate my house either. Anybody know how to get rid of the cockroaches? I get so annoyed because, like, I'll invite people over, but then a cockroach will spawn, and then they run away. <clears throat> As I said earlier, I do have two photos of Aurora <laughs> that she gave me. Oh my god, I also have one for Filbert. I miss him so much. He was, like, my third villager. And then he wanted to leave, and I was sad. I, the reason why I have the water floor is because I think the splishing sound is really funny. <laughs> um. <laughs> okay, the only section I really started decorating was the kitchen. Here for the kills, you're gonna w have to wait a, a little bit more, okay? Um, I, st I started decorating my kitchen. Um, <laughs> I am such a hoarder, like, this is why if I ever have a house, I'm just gonna have too much junk. 
as you can see, I didn't know where to put everything because I didn't have enough like platforms to put stuff on. So everything is just on the floor for now. I like the grocery shop wall. I think that's kind of cute. Touching. <clears throat> I decided to go with green walls because, you know, that's hip, trendy, kind of retro. <laughs> yes, I know. I have a lot of stuff. I just don't know where to put it. This is literally my actual house. <laughs> my parents are low-key hoarders, so, like, I learned from them. Um, I literally forgot to take down the stockings from not... 2021 Christmas, but 2022 Christmas. So those have just been up for forever. <laughs> hey! Hi, Yana! Yeah, I finally did it! I finally did it! Thank you to chat for coming into stream and, like, helping me get affiliate, but... Yeah, we're killing everyone today. Um, this was gonna be, like, a, a home music studio. No sub badges? Not yet. I wanted to talk about like what chat wanted to make for badges and stuff because ultimately um, you guys are paying for the subs. So, like I kind of want what you guys reflected in what I choose for badges and emotes, which we're going to talk about later. So we'll get to it. <clears throat> um, so I just put all of the music I got on the wall. And I have these rocks because my inventory was full because I have too much junk. <laughs> the house is a mess. <laughs> I should have made it look pretty for you guys, but you know, it doesn't matter. We're killing everyone in 10 minutes. I don't remember what this room was. <clears throat> oh, <laughs> I guess this is just my spare room. And nothing cool there. Oh, I forgot to change my title. Because I had special commands for today. You know, gotta farm subs a little bit. Oh, there is- Okay, I guess there is a character limit for titles. <laughs> okay, what, one sec. One second. There we go. There we go. That's explaining why I don't have um, emotes yet, guys. Sag. What's downstairs? <laughs> um. <laughs> Nothing as well, Rip. <clears throat> I don't know if I put anything in upstairs either. If you can tell, like, I'm pretty boring. If I had an actual house, <laughs> literally nothing. <laughs> if I had an actual house, like, I'm very minimalistic, like, I don't need a lot of stuff. But, like, this would literally be my house if I had a house. Um, yeah. I think it's so random how I have the snowy windows up as well. I don't know. My house is just a mess. Me, IRL. Um, yeah, I think that's it. I think it's time to end it all. I wish there was a way to like save some stuff like save some items or like save your money because let's see how much money it actually has I think I have a couple million oh my god 300k points Yeesh. Oh my god, 21 million. <laughs> Just all down the drain. Uh. I know I talked to Yana a while ago about doing like, what I do delete it, like do a garage sale, but it was like, no, I'll just throw everything away. How do I even delete the save? Wait, do you have to exit to the title screen and then click settings? I think that's how you do it, right? I've never done this, so I don't know. Yeah, I think that's how you're supposed to delete it, right? 
I want to talk to Aurora one more time before we kill her. <laughs> See if she's still at home. Oh, she is. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Let's see our final goodbyes. Wait, I need to give her a present. I need to leave on a good note. <laughs> Death day. More like doomsday, man. Yeah, let's go take care of the prettiest flower we can find. <laughs> exactly. Um, I think Aurora will like these red violet roses. Yeah, let, let's go. That's the prettiest flower I have. I'd give her the gold ones, but I don't have any. Oh, I for I was like, I wish there was a way I could run, but I forgot. Just hold down B, Sag. <laughs> How do I do it? <laughs> oh my god, I do feel at home. Oh yeah, let's give her the flower. Oh my god. Is there like- there's no like hug emotion is there, huh? Oh, what's on my mind? The thought that I have to kill you, man. God, she's the sweetest. Oof. I've read that the right per questions can reveal someone's personality. With that in mind, are you into comics? What kind do you like? Um, um, I like manga more. There's no option for manga. <laughs> An autobiography themed comic? Seems kind of a weird category. Let's choose fantasy. That's the closest. I'm a shoujo fan myself. Okay. I've talked to everyone I've wanted to talk to. So just Molly and Aurora because everyone else is kind of mid. I think it's time to end it all. Okay. I think you have to exit the game, reload it, and then delete it, I believe. I've never done this, so I don't know. <clears throat> Just awkward silence. Uh, feels bad. Because I've seen the cutscenes for Deleting the Island. So, how y'all doing? <laughs> you guys excited? Okay. We're gonna go to settings. I'm like holding my controller up because I'm nervous. I'm like scared. <laughs> Uh oh. This is where I take on important requests related to settings. <laughs> I need my dad. <laughs> I'm done talking. Yeah, let's just not delete it. Is this the option to delete it, I think? So you're thinking about leaving Timlin, huh? Hey. Well, I'm afraid that because you're our resident representative, I can't help you leave Timlin. Oh, okay. So that's not it. Oh, okay. That's that's not what we want to do. We want to kill everyone. We don't want to relocate. 
Yeah, never mind. That's not what we're going for. No! <laughs> Anybody know how to delete the island? <laughs> I obviously don't know how. Okay, let's try again. <laughs> Maybe the game is telling me not to delete everything. Yeah, it's happening. <laughs> Am I late? No, you're you're good. You're good. It is happening. <laughs> Is it save data? <gasps> it is! Okay, let's listen to what it actually is. <clears throat> yes, fairy, be my dad. Be my mom, please. I need an adult. Okay. Yes, I can explain things, but it may take a little bit of time. It's all very important information, so do listen carefully before making any decisions. You see how, like, he leans forward? That's, like, so scary. Okay. Usually, residents like you can chat with me here about deleting resident reg registrations. In other words, I'm talking about deleting player save data for Animal Crossing New Horizons. You can't delete only one player save data from system settings on the Nintendo Switch home menu. So, if you want to delete information about a player living on this island, please talk to me here instead. Now, <laughs> now, allow me to explain in more detail what it means to delete a player's registration- a resident registration. I can't talk, I'm so nervous, I'm so scared. If deleted, all memories of them and their property on Tiblin will be erased. That's what we're looking for, guys. We want to delete everything clean slate. This includes their home, money, and miles. But they'll also be erased from me- from my and other residents' memories. Additionally, if that resident enabled island backup, that setting will also be erased. Oh, frick. <laughs> yeah, do it, fairy, do it. <laughs> Go out with a bang. However, your situation is different. You play a very important role on Tiblin as the resident representative. You and this island are set. Tiblin would no longer be able to function properly if you were to leave us. Oh my god. That's why I cannot accept any requests from you here to delete your own resident registration. If you insist on deleting your data, since you are the resident representative, your only option is to delete all saved data for the game. To do this, go to the Nintendo Switch home menu and select System Settings. Once there, select Data Management, then look for Deletes- I gotta take notes! <laughs> I fucking forgot everything already! <laughs> okay, so I go to System Settings, Data Man- Someone type- I'm typing that in chat. Um, System Settings? Fuck, I can't spell system settings. Data, oh, man management. Delete, save data. Oh. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I'm not, I don't care about spelling. Oh. Okay, so I select the game, delete all save data for the software. You should know, though, that this method can't be used to delete just a single player save data. Again, it would delete all save data for the game. That is, it'll delete the entire island. Okay, that is what we want. We want a fresh start. Now, with that said, how can it help you? Um. Why am I deleting everything? I promised chat once I hit affiliate, I'm deleting the island. That's what I promised chat. <laughs> Power remove. Yeah, girl boss. Um. <laughs> Wait, so. Do I still have to delete the registration? Oh, they're talking about, like, if I have, like, other accounts on the Switch, right? Oh, okay, I understand. I wasn't listening. 
Okay, so I have to go into settings and delete. Okay, I got it. I got it now. <laughs> Kick Tom Nook in the face. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> okay, I don't know if I, c I should screen share because I don't think it would leak anything if I go to settings. Okay, but I'm going to switch to full cam while I'll do this just in case. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> oh! Wrong button. <laughs> wrong button. <laughs> full cam, yeah, we're on full cam. Okay, so I can show screen here. I'm not gonna leak anything. Okay. Real quick, real quick, I actually want to see how many hours I have in this game. Because I have, I swear to god, like 700 hours in Animal Crossing. Oh my god! Okay, I, I, good thing I didn't show because I would have leaked my friend code. I have 660 hours in Animal Crossing, which is a lot. That is a lot. And it's all. <laughs> Being thrown down the drain. Okay. I think I can show now. So data management. Manage software. Oh, me and my sister share. She's the one who plays Fortnite, not me. I'm not cringe. Oh yeah, I gotta close the game. Yeah, my memory's almost full, man. Wait. You said delete software, right? I'm like, I, I forgot what he said. What? <laughs> I, I have to... Okay, the software and icon on the home menu, menu will be deleted to manage storage space. Downloadable software can be re-downloaded from the Nintendo eShop. So do I have to remove the card and then delete it? Is that it? Is that what he said to do? Guys, I forgot. I was not paying attention. I need a walkthrough on how to delete the island. <laughs> Mods. <laughs> Gotta aim and build. Okay, so I'm gonna try eject the card like it says and see if that is what I'm supposed to do. Or wait, I can just check my logs and see what I typed. Is it happening? <laughs> okay, it says data management delete save data. Like, that's not, that's literally not what is on my screen though. Am I just DOM? Like, do I not get it? Guys, I did not prepare for this. I was not ready, okay? That is going to be my excuse. Because there's no delete save data option, right? Because it says delete software. Am I dumb? Take the card out. Okay, I'll do that. I'll do that. Maybe that thing only comes up when I take the card out. I took it out. Wait, I, I literally just took the card out. I think this is what I'm supposed to do? Okay, so it's not there anymore. Okay, so we're gonna... Did I do it right? We're gonna we're gonna see if I did it right. We're gonna put the card back in. No, did I, did I 
Did I do it? That wasn't it? What am I supposed to do? Bro, I don't fucking know. I need a tutorial. What? Why did you keep saying bro? What am I supposed to do? I don't know. I've never done this before. <clears throat> am I not supposed to... Your chat delay? No, it's you, man. Are you on mobile? Are you a mobile viewer? Am I dumb? <laughs> Mobile viewer Andy. Uh Okay, let me actually look up how I'm supposed to delete it. Because I don't think I did it right. Oh fuck. Wrong wrong button. Okay. Because, like, when I went to manage software, there was no delete save data option. <laughs> yeah, they're hanging on for dear life. Go back to save. Okay, there's literally. Okay. It says, on your Nintendo Switch, head to system settings. Open data management. Okay. Oh! I just didn't scroll down far enough. Oh, no. I'm fucking stupid. Oh, because when I did delete software, it just deletes, like, the game from my console, huh? <sighs> okay, this is it, right, Katie? This is it? <laughs> oh my god, I'm so D-O-M. So cocky. I know. I thought I knew what I was doing. Well, did you hear that sound? Oh, it's, it's scary. It's like horror game shit. Oh, that's weird. Cause like you click on it, it makes you think about it for five seconds. Okay, so if this is how we delete it. I would just like to say um my final goodbyes. Okay, so I would like to say goodbye to all the residents of Tiblin, even though I only cared about Aurora and Molly. Everyone else is kind of in, but yeah, one final. Salute to Tiblin. All 660 hours were fun, but we must start anew. We're doing it. We're doing it. I'm pressing A. We're doing it. Oh my god, that was, that was so quick. <laughs> like, this one jabbed straight to the heart. Oh no. <laughs> Okay, well, the game is still updating, so I I guess I can't play it. <laughs> um, So it's going to take a bit until it's updated so we can actually see if I deleted it correctly. Um, So we'll do that later. We'll come back to that, guys. <clears throat> um, While we're waiting for that, I was going to do Mario Kart, but since I most of my games I have are the cartridge, I can't take out the Animal Crossing one and put Mario Kart in. So, um, while we're waiting for that to update, wait, can you play the game while it's updating? Oh, but then it'd probably make you close the game, huh? The download will pause the software being played uses, oh yeah, so we can't open it. Okay, so we can talk about what emotes chat wants. I'm gonna rearrange the schedule a little bit. Um, <laughs> so... <laughs> Yeah. 
Um, how's everyone doing? We're in, out into about an hour into stream, having fun so far. <laughs> oh yeah, okay. So I made a little quick presentation on different emotes that I want to have. So first, it took me thirty minutes to make this, so be nice to me, okay? So here I have pictured a few of my favorite emotes. To me, I think emoticons or sub emotes are so important to chat culture because one, um, to me, emote spam is the best chat. If there's like 80% emote spam, a few jokes and trolls mixed in, then some like hot takes, I think that is the best chat. That is what I want from my chat in the future. Um, I like memers. I like trolls to a capacity because I myself am a meme troll. So um, these are just a few of my favorite emotes that... Um, I personally have a Twitch Turbo subscription, which um, you can look into it yourself, okay? Um, hate the one on the left. It's funny. It's funny. Okay, let's, let's get my pen out again. I'm going to change the color to red because we want to be extra. So these two emotes right here are um, Miskip's emotes. <laughs> the lag is so funny. Oh, my God. Um, they're both animated emotes. The one on the left, top left, is like called Mizkif Note, and it's just like the little um, Pepe, like just riding. I think it's so funny because I like the emotes to where it's an action of what the streamer is doing, right? Those are my favorite emotes. <clears throat> and then this one right here is, or these two actually are Connor Eats Pants emotes, which I think are so funny. One, because Among Us is such a good meme. I want to have an Among Us um, emote because I think, like, you know, red um, Among Us characters sus, right? It, it's so funny. It's so iconic, okay? And I think this Connor one is called Connor 6 What? I think it is, where it's just, like, a screen cap of his, like, like kind of, like, weird face. I, I love those emotes so much because, one, it's, like, original to the channel because it's literally the streamer's face. And... <laughs> it's it's just funny because it's kind of like that's a weird take like there's so many different emotes you can use for different reasons and i like the versatility of these two channel emotes um i love the emotes where it's just like the character or an illustration of the streamer just, just hugging a heart i think it's so cute it's adorable it's my favorite like we definitely need one of those <laughs> So these ones on the left are channels that I specifically subscribe to. Shut up, fairy. <laughs> We're waiting for Animal Crossing to update, okay? This is my backup presentation <laughs> to, like, stall for time, okay? Um. Anyway, so the ones on the left are reasons why I subscribe to the channel because I like the emotes. They're so versatile. They're, like, they don't necessarily... Um, are pertaining to the channel like you can use it in any chat and people understand what it is i like that a lot um the ones on the left here these ones on the right are, are animated emotes these are like my favorite to see in chat because dance. these ones are um bttv or frank face z emotes i believe they're called um and just seeing like motion and chat along with regular still emoticons is fun like i think chat is one entertaining and amusing to the streamer but mainly for chatters as well like when i watch streams like i can just watch chat and be happy because chatters are actually kind of funny i don't know who knew and then i love animated ones right now twitch literally just announced hey okay i that was you fairy right <laughs> Let me see. Yeah, thank you for the five gifted fairy. Thank you. I appreciate it. We hit the goal. Thank you. Let's go ahead and edit that goal. I'm only gonna have um probably sub goal on stream for this stream. Cause I think it's kind of cringe. I'd rather have like a follow goal on screen rather than a sub goal. There we go, updated. Any simps wanna give me more subs, go for it. Um anyway. This was planned. <laughs> Me and Fairy talked about this. But yeah. Thank you, Fairy. <laughs> anyway, back to the 
presentation. So these right here in the center right, Sag and Copium, are just my favorite to spam in like other people's chat. Because Sag, like farming Sag is so funny. Like just getting people <laughs> to acknowledge like you're sad is really funny. And like Copium, that's a new Pepe amount, but it's so good. Like it's so good. It's kind of like basically saying that, oh, you're gaslighting us or like, ah, really? Like you're joking. Like Copium, it's it's so good. My fi I think my all-time favorite thing about just emote culture in general is it's kind of like an inside joke, right? Like you won't necessarily know the meaning of the emote by just looking at it. Kind of like how my boss caught me. I'm sorry, fairy. <laughs> Thank you for your service. Thank you for the subs. Was it worth? Was it worth? <laughs> um. Anyway. <clears throat> Um, cause like emails are like an inside joke. It's very much like a Twitch thing. Like if you look at chats in YouTube streams, it sucks. It's not cool. It's not fun. The thing that I like about how Ludwig went to YouTube is how he has his own extension. Um, to where, hey, thank you for the five, Rainy. I appreciate it. I do have a um tip link in my about section. So if anyone wants to give me like a cold hard cash, you can do it there. But only just don't. Okay, I wanted to talk about and address the tipping thing. I talked about this with Katie and Rainy offstream, but I have it minned at five because if you can't afford to drop less than five, then you should not be tipping me, okay? Put it out there. And also, I maxed it at 10 because you should not be giving people more than 10 bucks at a time because I will see clips of streamers being like, tipped or donated to like thousands of dollars and I think that's a bit much you why are you dropping so much like I understand you want streamers attention and it's fun and it's cool and it's nice but don't do that please like I feel guilty when people buy me stuff in general so that's why it's mint at five and <laughs> speak for yourself yeah that's why it's my own tipping page okay <laughs> and um max at 10 so that I have that explanation in, in the about section but that's just why. Um, JK. <laughs> um, no, you're fine. I know you're goof and we talked about this before. Um anyway, you guys stop giving me money. You're distracting me from my presentation. Okay. Uh what was I saying? Oh yeah, so like emo culture on its own is like an inside joke. So like I want to have like community memes. Or like community emotes that's why i didn't like purchase them before this stream i wanted to like chat and like current subscribers to help decide what emotes they themselves would like to use in chat so that i only have two slides so that's slide number one hey slide number two <laughs> um possible emotes as of right now i think i have one slot for animated and a few slots for follower emotes, and then a few slots for regular subscriber emotes, I believe. So, I my goal is to get, like, some made within a month. That way, anyone who subscribed during this first month will have a say in what emotes are being made. I wanted to make, like, an ask sub submission, like, website that people could submit ideas to. But I don't know if I'll do that. I'll think about it. I will think about it. Um, so possible emotes. I've talked to a few people off stream about this as well, but related to the current game or meta of the channel. So like my current meta or like arc or games that I play is Stardew Valley and Mario Kart. I think to like cope, C-O-P-E, all caps, is the, <laughs> the first through 12. <laughs> it's so good. It's so good. Like, if I just look at chat and I see that, it's like, you guys are memeing, but it's so funny. Because, like, that's related to, like, the Mario Kart meta, right? And KG suggested that I should have, like, a Stardew Valley hoe emote, like an animated one for, like, the action of the hoe hitting the ground. I think that would be funny. Um, Inside jokes are channel memes. So that one will have to wait a bit because, like, we need to think about, like, what jokes we have. I think a common phrase that I say is like, oh, Megan taking notes kind of related back to like the miskip note emote, miskip note emote. I think that one would be kind of relevant. <laughs> Shut up, Brady. I, okay, I prepped this in literally 15 minutes, okay? 
I was gonna do it last night, and then I got tired, so I made it right before a stream. Anyway. <laughs> um, kind of like how I do, like, asides. I think that's kind of funny. And, like, little Snickers. I think, like, an animated emote where I'm, like, going like this and, like, laughing. I think that would be really funny and cute. Um... That's impressive. Yeah, this is like all my school assignments. Just waiting until the last minute. Um, screen caps of face or reactions. Kind of like the Connor 6 what emote. I'm not circling. Sorry, you guys probably don't know what I'm referring to. But like this Connor 6 what emote. I think it's really funny. Because one, it pertains to the channel. And also like, it's just funny to meme it, right? <clears throat> and then for my first like animated emote, I definitely want it to be a hype one. Yeah, so I was gifted a sub to the X12 channel, and I see you spam this, like, hype emote all the time, and I think it's really cool and fun. But all these four at the bottom, the first one is a miscuff. It's miscuff hypers, and it's just, like, little people jumping up and down. It's really cute, like, he's dancing. Second one is the parrot dancing one. That one is a BT TV emote, I believe. Um, The x Falls type, and then this little dog is just, like, him, like, bobbing up and down theoretically listen to, listening to music so those are just kind of like the baseline emotes that i want subs to have um so yeah that's kind of what so if anybody has like ideas or suggestions like tell me that way i have an idea what subs want um like i said earlier i want my emotes not to just pertain to me but be versatile enough to where like someone who doesn't necessarily have to like my personality or my streams to also understand and like the emotes that I have. Because like I said earlier, um, these emotes on the left here are, are emotes in which I subscribe to the channel just specifically to have those emotes to put in chat. So yeah, that is all. That is my presentation. And it actually worked out perfectly because Animal Crossing is updated now. So we can go back to that and see if I actually did it correctly. Okay, to explain the users, this is my sister. She wanted to meme on James Charles a little bit. That's why her user is, hi, sisters. Okay, I forgot. You, you only need the friend code, so I'm not going to leak anything. Um, This is my stream account, and this is my personal. I think I'm going to do this on my stream. Yeah, we'll do it on my stream account. Okay, let's see if we did it right. Crossing my fingers that everyone died. It's loading. I forgot what, like, the start of the game is like. <clears throat> oh, I also forgot to mention, if people subscribe, I will write your name in a journal at end of stream. I would do it throughout the stream, but I find it distracting, so we'll do it at the end. Oh my god, I did it right. Oh my god, the little pitter-patter. Good afternoon. We're so excited to have you here. Let us be the first to congratulate you on your wise decision to sign up for this adventure. Welcome to the check encounter for your deserted island getaway package. There's so much to look forward to, but first, let us introduce ourselves. I'm Timmy with Nick Incorporated. And I'm Tommy. <laughs> I'd be Tommy. <laughs> Just like echoing the whatever the other person is saying. We'll be flying to the island with you to help you get you settled. Think of us as your partners. We're in it for the long haul, so let's get started, shall we? The first step is checking your application. Is this your first time applying for one of our packages? Uh, I guess it is since I deleted everything. In this alternate universe, I was never on the island. Understood. Now then, we need to look up your application. Can we have your name and birthday? Um, um, y'all, I've leaked my birthday, so I don't think anyone cares. Um, I kind of want to name it Megan, or name myself <laughs> Megan, because I think having my user piece in it in dialogue is kind of weird. 
I also, for a potential emote, I want to have a Pikachu one because my dad's nickname for me is Megachu. Like Pikachu, Megachu. Um, don't call me that, please. Only he can call me Megachu. Got it. Uh, but I would like to have a Pikachu themed emote at some point. To Megan. Uh, don't put offensive words. Got it. <laughs> We're playing slots, guys. <laughs> okay, I missed my number. Oh, I was close. I was close. Off by one. Okay, there we go. Yeah, April 24th is my birthday. Let's see. Oh yes, here you are. Our next step will be to take a picture of you. Oh fuck. No, no, no pictures. I hated this. My state ID photo is so bad. Cause like I wore my hair totally back. It does not look good. Oh, okay. I thought it we had to take an actual picture. <laughs> I'm a little bit brown. I love like bob cuts with bangs. It's so cute. But I think this one is closest to my hair actual hairstyle. Almost has a widow peak on there. Okay, there we go. That's good for now. Great, you're all set. I'll just go ahead and add that picture to your records. And now, let's start talking about your new home. So exciting. You see, we're very proud of the work we've done to help you feel comfortable in your new life. Yes, in fact, if you want, you can even experience the seasons in the same way you're used to them. What I mean is, we have islands in both the northern and southern hemisphere. We recommend choosing an island that has the same seasonal pattern as your current home. So tell me, where do you live now? Um, North America. <laughs> Excellent. That information really helps us focus on just the right island for you. So, naturally, we'd recommend that you relocate to an island in the Northern Hemisphere. There are a few more decisions to make, but does that sound okay to you so far? That yeah, sounds good. Very good! We have a number of lovely, uninhabited islands in the Northern Hemisphere to choose from. Now then, all of our islands are approximately the same size, and they're all quite natural. So, don't worry about whether you'll have enough space or comfort. You can't go wrong. Just follow your instincts and choose an island with a layout that looks appealing. That's how I do it. I'll show you some maps now, and you can choose the best one for your new home. Um, let's see. Which island did I initially have? Oh, this was the one I had before, because I had both, I guess, rivers start from the ocean. Um... I kind of like the top left one because like how all the elevated areas are near the back of the island. I kind of like that. Hmm. Yeah, I'm I, digging either top left or top right. I think I'm going to go top left. I mean, they're all kind of the same, I guess. I don't know. Wonderful choice. I can't wait to show it off to you. Uh, but before we depart, I have just one final question for you. Ooh. If you could only bring one thing with you to a deserted island, what would it be? Uh... Okay, this is if you're like, you have survival instinct. If you want to have some tie back to society. If you're being real. Something to kill time. Hmm... Honestly, like, whenever we go on, like, road trips or something, I always bring, like, a sketchbook or a book to, like, keep me preoccupied. So probably my honest answer would be something to kill time. Oh, interesting. Oh, I'm sorry. That was just a hypothetical question. Think Incorporated will fully cover all of your basic needs. Oh, 
Oh, perfect timing. Come on, let's all board the plane together. I wanted to do a bit where I'm like, Hello, everyone. Thank you for taking this chartered flight as part of Nook Incorporated's des deserted island getaway package. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy a complimentary video presentation about deserted island life. Was that a good bit? Was that a good bit, guys? Did, did it work? Like, nice to see like the original trailer. <laughs> What's the guy hammering? <laughs> <clears throat> You know what I realized I forgot to do? I forgot to look at the museum one last time. I think my museum, hands down, is my favorite part of the whole island. Yeah, at least we know we deleted my save file correctly. Oh, I hope I get Aurora again. I will be so sad if she doesn't spawn. We just crash land. <laughs> We're here. Now, I know you must be incredibly excited to explore your new island home, but I have one small request. Would you please join us for a short orientation ses session in the nearby plaza? Our fearless leader- Uh oh. <laughs> Sounded like some communist shit. Anyway, our fearless leader himself will be giving a presentation, so I hate for you to miss it. We're heading there right now if you'd like to move. Left joystick. And follow us. Or left stick, not joystick. We have little scarves. Oh my god. Oh, I have to talk to him. <laughs> Alright, is that everyone? Let's see. Is Plucky here? How about Antonio? And there's Megan, of course. Great, we're all here. I'll turn it over to you, Mr. Nook. Our three adventurers are ready to get started. Yes, very good. Let's see, how shall I begin? Yes, of course. Welcome, everyone. Welcome to your new island. My name is Tom Nook, and I'm the founder and president of Nook Incorporated. Today is the first day of our new life on this pristine, lovely island, so congratulations! And this is a package deal, hmm? As such, Nook Incorporated staff will always be here to support you and ensure your comfort and safety. But, first things first. I'd like each of you to choose a spot on your own. It's the first step to putting down some real roots. I'd like you to dream big. I do have certain connections in construction and real estate. And, uh, but I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's just, let's just get started with a simple tent, shall we? Please collect your tent from Timmy or Tommy and then choose a spot to place it. Easy. Here you go, your very own tent. So cute. Okay, once you find the perfect spot, press X to access your inventory. Then select your tent to place it. Don't worry, you'll get a chance to see what it looks like before making your final decision. And you'll want a little breathing room, so take your time finding a space that works for you. Oh, so I suppose I should probably set you up the map too, huh? 
<laughs> yeah, map would be nice. <laughs> would you put up your tent? Please find your way back here. Use your new map if you need it. Well, off you go. I hope you find a great spot. Oh, this feels so weird. Like, fresh start, new island. Okay. I kind of want to put my tent over here. Let's see where we are. I want to buy the water. I like the sound of, like, the waterfall just in the background. Probably right here. Yeah, let's see what she looks like. Hey! Thank you for the prime sub, fairy. You know, taking money from Bezos. Thank you, man. It's an honor to have your prime sub. But thank you, fairy. Is this a good spot? Yeah, I like it. I, I kind of like how the tree blocks the tent a little bit. Makes the shot a bit more artsy. Yeah, I assume I talk to them again, yeah? <clears throat> ah, you must have found a suitable spot for your tent, huh? You're the first one back, so I suppose the others must still be searching for just the right location. You know, since you've already done some scouting, the others may appreciate your assistance. I guess we gotta find them. I've forgotten what, like, the beginning of the game is like. It's been so long. Oh, Antonio! But, yo! I'm Antonio, you're Megan, right? Nice to look. I thought he said, nice to look at you. <laughs> nice to meet you. You already set up your tent, huh? I'm still trying to find the perfect spot. I'll be doing some serious cardio, so I... I hate the athletic characters so much. They're so ego. They're so annoying. I, I hate them so much. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> we're just still going to be nice to him. I'll be doing some serious cardio, so it's gotta have lots of fresh air. I think this spot will do the trick, but I don't know. What do you think? I think it looks good. I don't care, man. I don't like your type anyway. You think so? Awesome. Okay, then. How about we do a little visual... <laughs> it's a difficult word. Visualization exercise together. If I put my ten here... Pretty cool, huh? Or right? <laughs> I think it looks good. I don't care, man. Alright, looks like we have a winner. I'm gonna put down stakes right here and never look back. That was a tough decision. You totally saved my glutes. We saved his ass? Okay. <laughs> I wonder how that plucky is doing. You might be having as much trouble as I was, so maybe you should go see if she needs help. Okay, let's go find plucky. Oh, right here. Easy. You're... Wait, I got it. Don't tell me. You're Megan, right? See, told you I had it. I'm Plucky. Gotta tell you, I'm excited to do this whole island thing. Chicky poo? <laughs> I don't like that pet name. I miss Aurora so much. I miss when she called me baby. Um, You already found a good spot, huh? I was trying to just feel for the best spot, but I was having trouble because every spot feels like the best one. <laughs> they have anxiety brain like me. Um, let's see. I couldn't just sit here thinking over forever, so I grabbed a stick and threw it, and here's where it landed. So now this is my spot. Okay, I know this only so far I could throw this. Okay. I need to learn how to read. So now this is my spot. Okay. I know there's only so far... I could throw the stick, but I'm liking this. That just sounds weird to say. I failed my AP senior English exam. So, <laughs> that's why I can't read, guys. English is my first language. I think it looks good. I don't care. As long as you don't live near me. I like being isolated. 
For real? Well, if you're sure. Actually, let, let's think about this a little. God, why would you ask for my opinion? Okay. If I put my tent here... <clears throat> looks nice, don't it? Yeah, like I said, it looks perfectly fine. Okay. Awesome. From now on, this won't be just anywhere on the island. It's gonna be my home sweet home. I can't believe I got such an awesome spot. You rock. Hold up. Does this mean you helped Antonio with his tent too? Whoa, you're seriously... You're a seriously awesome person. I know. <laughs> We gotta be honest, when we first got here, I was kind of worried there were way too few of us. But if we get to live here with someone like you, I can totally rest easy. Oh my god, they're being a kiss ass. Okay. Huh, everyone is probably waiting on us, so let's get back to the plaza. They seem like the neighbor who will bring you bread and cookies every weekend, which I love those neighbors. Okay. Welcome back, everyone. I hope you all found just the right spots to set up your new homes. Of course, you can sleep on it for a while, huh? Really get a feel for how it suits you. And with that taken care of, we can move on to more serious business. Like throwing an island warming party. We'll have it right here in the plaza with a roaring campfire. We're just need a few supplies to get started, yes? Since we'll all be living here together, this will be a good test of our teamwork. Let's see. Oh, I was waiting. <laughs> Timmy, Plucky, Tommy, and Antonio can set up things here in the plaza. Meanwhile, Megan and I will, be, will work on gathering firewood and perhaps a little snack. Alright, everyone. Let's get to it. Megan, would you come see me for a moment? When the teacher asks to see you after class. Uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. <laughs> I don't want to talk to the teacher just yet. I'll leave the setup to us. I'll be counting on you to get the supplies. No, <laughs> I don't want to talk to Tommy, though. Or Nook. Oops. They're all the same. Ah, I just wanted to go over what we'll need for the campfire. I think roughly ten tree branches to do the trick. You can find them scattered about the island. So, when you find one lying on the ground, just plus why to pick it up. Easy. Easy clap. Meanwhile, I'll investigate the apple-like items growing in the trees. I suspect they're real apples. Nah, they're probably star of them, man. I get some sticks. Get the one stick. Two. The I can't read, but I can count good. Oh, I <laughs> got a weed. That was three, right? Yeah, we got three sticks. A four. Five. Six. This bit is probably annoying. But I don't care. Wait, how many do I have? <laughs> Six. <laughs> Let's get a stone for good measure, just in case. Seven. Eight. Two more. And nine. And a ten. Let's get one extra one just in case I drop one by accident. I love the sound of the footsteps in all the seasons. It's so, like, comforting. <laughs> what are they doing? <laughs> they're, they're a bit too close to each other, huh? Okay, I got my sticks. Ah, good! It looks like you managed to collect up the tree branches, huh? You found even more than I asked. Yeah, I'm an overachiever. I want the teacher to like me, okay? You found even more than I asked. I only need the ten, but I'm sure you'll find it good use for the rest. I'll take what we need off your hands now. Yes, that should be perfect, or that should be plenty for our campfire. You made quick work of that. I'm quite glad that I'll be sharing this desolate island with such a hard worker. Oh. I can do a pretty good Mickey laugh. I, that's the only impression I can do. <clears throat> and speaking of surviving on a desolate island, our next task is to round up something to snack on. While you were collecting branches, I was evaluating the fruit that seemed to be abundant here. 
They look like apples. They smell like apples. And they even taste like apples. In fact, they are 100% without a doubt genuine apples. So, will you collect six of them for me? Now, I'm sure that you don't need much guidance here, but just in case. In case I'm actually just small-brained. <laughs> if you see a tree growing apples, you can press A to shake it. Then just pick the fruit up. Easy. Alright, I'm sure you'll have plenty of apples for us in no time. Hot take? Apples are kind of mid. I think my favorite type of apple is honey crisp, but if I have a ch um, an option for like fresh fruit, I'd rather go for like a peach or an apricot. I like juicy fruits. Apples aren't juicy enough for me. Wait, how many do I need? I need six, right? But let's get more, be an overachiever again. You like oranges? I like oranges. I like orange- okay, orange juice with pulp is god tier. No one can fight me on that. Well, well, I knew you were the right one for the job. Thank you once again. I'll go ahead and take those apples off your hands to get started on the preparations. Uh, rainy based rainy take. Let's go. Any take that agrees with me, I'm gonna call based, okay? Just a heads up, guys. <clears throat> now, is that everything? Yes, I believe it is. Let's get started with the festivities. At last, allow me to properly welcome you to your new island. I have participated in many adventures and endeavors over the years, but this may be the most exciting. Helping develop a thriving new community entirely from scratch will truly test my business acumen. And perhaps my skills in an out as an outdoorsman, huh? Now, we may not have the kind of numbers that I originally envisioned, but that just means we'll have to rise to the challenge. And, ha and I have no doubt that with hard work and perseverance will shape this deserted island into... I, su I suppose we can't call this a deserted island anymore, huh? Oh, what we... What? Oh, sorry. Too many words. I'm trying to talk too fast. Okay. Well, what should we call it? Okay, what should we call it? I kind of want to call it Tiblin again. To honor Aurora. <laughs> I sense a great opportunity. As the first residents of this island, we should be the ones to name it. And in the spirit of democracy, we should put it to a vote. Majority rules, huh? So, take a little time to think. When everyone is ready, I'll present your ideas. Ooh. Okay. I low-key want to name it, like, Tiblin 2.0. Because I just love the name Tiblin. I think it's so cute. Like, it rolls off the tongue so easily. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna name it Tiblin again. <laughs> Anxiety rain. I'm not creative enough to think of name a Taco Bell. No. No amount of money can make me change it from Tiblin 2.0. Okay. <clears throat> Tibland. Cause like Tibland kind of sounds like Timberland. That's I think that's why I like it. Let's see. Or Tiblon. Tiblin. I I'm just gonna do like. Maybe Tibland. Tibland. Tib Tibbleland. Tibland? I kinda like it with the D at the end actually. That sounds it sounds kinda like funny. Like weird, I mean, but like kinda like it. Tibland. Kinda like land. Tibland. Yeah, I like that. Okay, I actually like that a lot. If you put bad words in the name, do you get banned? Question? Okay. Alright, is everyone ready? Let's try saying our ideas all at the same time. <laughs> the best way to handle arguments. Ready? Go! Oh, Bellevue, that's kind of- Bellevue? The real town in Washington. That's kind of cute, though. Okay. What splendid variety, yes! Each one is a potential gem. Now for the voting. I'll say each name in order, and you can clap for the one you think is best. Megan seems to have the enthusiasm and naming sensibilities. Easy. <laughs> of course I do. 
let's start there. So, Megan suggested Nibbland. Oh, there we go. Easy. Wow, there's an overwhelmingly positive response. Each and every one of you clapped. I suppose if everyone is in agreement, we could just go with Tibbland. Splendid. Then from now on, this island will be known as Tibbland. Well, Megan, since you've proven yourself by naming Tibbland, this is like reminiscent of like in high school or junior high how, the, how there's like popularity contests. Like, I'm the popular kid for once. I'd like to rely on you for other critical decisions we'll need to make on this island. Yes, I hereby name you the resident representative of Tibland. If only it was that easy to get elected, man. Could you please say a word or two as the new spokesperson for your neighbors? <laughs> Do we want to be smart asses? Appeal to the Republicans? Or be nice libs? Um, let's be nice libs. <clears throat> you can count on me. Hmm. So, we've settled on a name for our island, and we've selected our resident representative. It's been a big day, but it's gotten rather late, so let's have a toast. Everyone have a beverage in hand? It's fresh juice made from apples, and our new resident representative harvested on this very island. Then, without further ado, a toast. The Tibbalin and the happiness of its residents. Okay. Cheers! Let me drink my water. That's so cute. He's playing to the beat. Oh, I should probably talk to him. Huh? Having fun? I'm gonna kick off with a new workout routine tomorrow, so I'm gonna take it easy tonight. Yeah, farewell, Island. Yeah, hi, Vora. Welcome to chat. You missed it, but <laughs> we had a whole ordeal deleting the island, but this is my new one now. Tiblin 2.0. Thank you for coming into chat. We're doing well today, man. Okay. You're partying around a campfire on a deserted island? Wow, now this is- <laughs> now this rocks. We're here to act as your support staff, but you've never lived on an uninhabited island before either. I'm not sure how helpful we'll be in this unfamiliar place, but we'll we'll rely on each other as fellow residents. We'll let this campfire burn for the rest of the night. Feel free to rest in your tent if you start to feel tired. Ah, before I do that, there's something we need to give you. Please talk to Mr. Nook about it. Well, what if I don't want to, though? Yeah, because I don't have any tools, so I can't really do anything. Can I go in the tent? I don't think I can yet. Oh! <laughs> Uh-oh! <laughs> he caught me! Excuse me, we're setting up resident services- We're setting up a resident services- <laughs> I cannot talk. Um, facility in there, but it's not ready for you just yet. Please give us a little more time to get things ready for you. Okay, fine. I won't trespass just yet. Even though I want to. Ah, having a good time, yes? I know this is all a bit much, so... If you feel like taking a short nap in your tent, by all means, go ahead. We'll keep the fire burning. Sounds good to me. But first, you'll probably want this. It's your very own camping cot. You'll want to set it up in your tent before you lie down. Oh, and there are a few packages waiting in your tent as well, huh? There's a few items that might be useful. Go put packages and use the things inside, press A. And when you're ready, you can move left stick to crawl into bed. <coughs> We've got another big day ahead of us tomorrow, so rest up as much as you can tonight. Yes, that's all for me for now. Sweet dreams. Aw, cute. For uh, another anarchist. <laughs> it's fun, though. It's fun. It's a chill game. I haven't touched it in a while. It's super chill. I like games that have a lot of direction. Like, anytime I try and play, like, an open world, I feel lost. That's just my opinion. 
As long as you like watching me play, then that's cool. We got a radio and a lamp. Can I put the radio on? It's just an emergency service announcement. <laughs> Talking about the tsunami that's incoming. Yeah, let's go to sleep. Pretend we didn't hear that service announcement. Go. Oh, looks like you've decided to make your own way in the world. Get out there, explore new frontiers. It was all the way right, Daddyo. You don't need to live by anyone's rules but your own. The world was made for exploring, you know? Living free, being out there, it's a great feeling. Yeah. But well, take it from a cat who's been on the road. Being by your lonesome can grind on the soul. You gotta make friends along the way. Rambling this crazy world in Squaresville without some pals. Yeah, man. Friends are where it's at. Base. Base take. Speaking of rambling, I'm doing a bit of that myself. My bad. Maybe it's about time for you to wake up. Your new life. Oh, but listen up. The rap I just gave you about friends? Pretty key. You'll did this island life a whole lot more if you share it with some friends, if that's your scene. Yeah. An island paradise with your best pal sounds pretty groovy to me. Cool. When you wake up, you'll be in sync with real time. Take that island life and I'll catch you later. Megan, are you in there? I hope I oh. <laughs> oh, I hope I haven't woken you up abruptly. How about I do wish to discuss something with you? I'll be here when you're ready. Ah, just let me sleep a little more, dude. Sounds like Mario Kart song. Cave Punk is currently playing. Ah, let's leave it on. Kill the battery. It's not like we're on a deserted island or anything. Stretch. Just woke up. Head into work. Oh, there you are. I hope you had a pleasant nap. Or, well, I suppose it was a bit more than a nap, wasn't it? It's a brand new day. <laughs> yes, it's quite normal to be worn out from such a long trip. And a major life event. Speaking of which, I have a few more things that you might find useful as you adjust to life in our little paradise. First, you'll need one of these, yes? Oh, so, phone. Let's go. It's a very old nook phone. I had, I had these made especially for island residents. Well, I want to make sure it's working right, so could you try turning it on for me? Good, good. Looks like you're getting good reception as well. Okay, feel free to put it away now. Hey. Have you ever used a smartphone before? <laughs> imagine not having a cell phone. That's like crazy to imagine. Yeah, I got one. Is the sound? Yeah, it's supposed to be like cicadas in the background. It irks me too. Yeah, 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 that that's what it is. It's Ikeda. It's called ambiance. <laughs> yeah, like sometimes like game sounds like trigger me. Where like I think it's like just like kind of like feedback, but it's the game. I promise my audio is not fucked up. 
Um, anyway. Very good. Then this should be a breeze for you. In fact, I think you'll find it much more useful than the foam you already have. Copium. I love my Samsung. Ah, yes. There's also a very useful app that contains advice for living here. Normally, this would not be free of charge, but as you're just getting started, consider it an extra bonus. It's called Island Life 101, and it is a message delivery service of sorts. Feel like giving it a try? Nah, I don't need it. I know what I'm doing. Oh my, you're quite certain. Well, I suppose figuring out your own way around new surroundings can be a fun adventure too, huh? Yes. If you change your mind, you can always get the app later at resident services. Alright, that's enough about the app for now. I do have one more thing for you, however. It's your itemized bill! So this includes everything. Airfare, accommodations, labor, tax, and... Of course, your nymph, huh? Bringing your grand total to the modest sum of... 49,800 bells. What are bells? Okay, that's fine. Reasonable. Yes, well, then... Wait, you don't have any bells! I can't believe I didn't think of this. <laughs> of course. Well, no need to worry. I was prepared for this for exactly this type of tricky situation. With the getaway package, you can pay your fees with miles instead of the standard bells. I call this extremely helpful service the Nook Mileage Program. Well, it's quite extraordinary if I do say so myself. With the Nook Mileage Program, you can earn miles by simply living your life here on Tiblin. I dare say, the more you enjoy your island life, the more Nook Miles you can earn. And you can use them to pay back your move-in fees and much more. So the bottom line is, you need 49,800 bells to pay your move-in fees, but with this new service. Would you believe it? It only comes to 5,000 miles. I'll just go ahead and register you so you can pay in miles. Yes. But there are more details available within your Nook phone. Just open the Nook Miles app. And you'll see that you've earned some miles just for traveling to the island and joining the program. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must get back to a few of the matters. But let me heartily congratulate you once again on your arrival. I'm so happy to have you as a resident of Tibland and a client of Nook Incorporated. Oh my god, people talk would be great. I will add that after stream. Thank you, Vora. That is such... That'd be perfect. Oh my god. Thank you. I will definitely add that emote later. From now on, island time will match the flow of time in the real world. Do not touch the power button when you see the autosave indicator in the top right screen corner. You can also save and quit your game after pressing minus. Easy. I know how to do this. Five hundred miles. Easy. We didn't have to do anything. Okay, so we got a fish, catch bugs. I got kid. Talk to neighbors. So we can do that one. Easy. Okay. Congratulations on your big move. We hope you enjoy your new island life. To celebrate this fresh start, we'd like to give you a gift that it that is sure to come in handy. Oh, I don't know how to <laughs> use the items yet. Okay, so I gotta get my tools. I think you gotta buy them, yeah? Ah, welcome, welcome. As you can see, it's quite cozy in here. It's funny how cozy doesn't actually mean comfortable, huh? Let me know if you need advice on how to spend your time on this island, or anything else. If you need some advice about basic island materials, you should talk to Timmy. 
He can help you oh, procure some of the essentials for thriving in our little paradise. And if you want to earn some bells, he has a rather generous policy of purchasing just about anything. Not strictly advisable from a business perspective, but quite generous. Oh, one more important thing. I'm offering a free DIY workshop that can help you really build out your island experience. <laughs> this is the tutorial, Laura. Come on, let him talk. <laughs> I think it would be quite useful. So, I do hope you take me up on it. I think it's funny to say, ah, uh, instead of hmm. Because that's like how I talk normally. I'm also going to try and say as much dialogue out loud because I just need to practice speaking more. So... Okay. Let's learn how to make stuff. Oh, I, I skipped the first dialogue. I'm sorry. Each participant will make and keep their own tools and receive a set of DOI recipes. I think it will be quite useful for Island Life, huh? So, shall I put you down for the next available session? Yeah, let's do it. Three classes, let's go. Yes, that's the island spirit. I happen to be free right this very moment, so let's get started. <laughs> it's like, let me sign you up right now. Welcome to my DIY workshop. Oh, I suppose workshop is overselling it a bit, huh? When you see how simple it is to DIY or do it yourself, you'll understand what I mean. The basic idea is to gather materials, follow a recipe, and then craft using a workbench like this one. So, today we'll be constructing a fishing rod using common materials that you can find anywhere. For this particular recipe, we require a mere five tree branches. It is admittedly a little flimsy. Now then, come see me once you've collected the materials, huh? Okay, let's go get some sticks. Easy. Yeah, so I think I will just do the tutorial on stream today. And then we can do Mario Kart later. Come on, where's the sticks? We got one. Easy. <clears throat> yeah, I also need to talk to my neighbors. Do I have Mario Party? I'm saving up to get the new Mario Party All-Stars game. Because me and a couple friends are talking about playing it on stream one day, but we all have to save up for the game. So, <laughs> if I get more subs, I'll play it sooner. Okay, where's the other guy? Where's Macho Antonio? Donde esta Antonio? Playing it through gameplay? Nice! My only concern about the new Mario Party is since Nintendo Online is kinda poopy. Like, I'm scared about like playing online and it lagging too much. Literally, where the frick is Antonio? Oh, right here. <laughs> I just had to wait two more seconds. Yo! I'm pumped about that spot you helped me pick out for my tent. Thanks for the push! <laughs> Machek Antonio? <laughs> I love Machek so much. It's so good. Um, I hope we can keep looking out for each other like this. It's good to have buddies. Oh, right. I've got something here for you. Thank you again for finding a place for my... Place. That explorer's hat is perfect for Tibland. You can try it on by pressing X to open up your pockets, then press A just like that item you want. Choose where if you want to put it on. You can always change it later if you need to work out. <clears throat> I've decided for this game, I will wear any gift my villagers give me. Even if it's ugly. But this hat is actually kind of cute. Okay, what was I doing? Oh, tutorial. The only thing I don't like about hats is that they're almost a bit too big. So when you're looking at overhead, you can't even see the character. But it's fine, it's from Antonio. We're gonna put it on. Kind of like when your grandma knits you a sweater, you put it on to make them happy, but you don't actually like it. You pretend you like it, but you don't. I'm gonna get some water. <laughs> I 
Yeah, drink that sodi pop. Ah, oh, found the necessary <laughs> found the necessary materials, huh? Well then, let's get started on crafting that fishing rod. Begin. Just select a project from the workbench and get started. Go ahead. Give it a try. Make the fishing rod. I love the fishing mechanic in this game so much. Like when I first started playing, I literally fished for three hours. And I was still having fun. Hey! Thank you for the follow. Eva Karma, I saw how you say it. If you have a preferred name or pronouns, tell me. But thank you for following and thank you for coming to chat. I'm doing pretty good. This is first affiliate stream, so I'm feeling really hyped. Um, I also had a lot of sugar this morning, so that's why I haven't crashed yet. But doing good. Hope you're doing well too, man. Just chilling. Yeah, it's gonna be pretty chill when we're doing Animal Crossing. So yeah, feel free and chat. Chill. Do whatever you want. Just be nice, okay? <laughs> That's my only rule. Be nice. Um, yes, that was perfect. As you can see, crafting is quite simple, provided you have the correct recipes, huh? And that concludes my free DIY workshop. Oh, there's just one last thing. I have a few common DIY recipes for you. Free of charge, naturally. Free copium. I'll just need to send them to your Nick phone. Would you mind opening it up? I love how there's so much green in my outfit. Green is my favorite color. Okay. Blended. Thank you. The DIY app is now installed on your phone and ready for you to use anytime. And the flimsy fishing rod you just crafted is yours to keep. It may not last forever, but it should serve you well for a little while at least. <clears throat> Speaking of fishing, I'm no master angler, but perhaps I can give you a few tips, huh? In my experience, you should aim in front of the shadow of a fish where you cast your line. I would love to see anything you manage to catch. I'm quite curious about the local fauna. I don't know if they're a bot, but like, don't self promo, guys. <laughs> bro, I love, bro, you're my favorite chatter. I love how you use your emotes. It's so freaking good. Your affiliate, yeah, I hit it on Saturday, so I can now farm Sims for subs. Um, yeah, I was so excited when I finally qualified for affiliate. Shout out to my chatters, thank you to anyone who's been in stream recently. I've tried to like improve my content a little bit over the past couple weeks, and it seems to have worked. Copium. Um, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> I literally forgot what he told me to do. He told me to go fishing, right? <laughs> Come on, we just need 5k miles. Just need 5k. Oh, I can learn how to make the workbench now. <clears throat> My thing with self promo is, is like you can talk about if you stream or whatever, but don't be like too explicit about it unless it. Like, if we're talking about it, you can mention it and bring it up, but don't, like, self-probo too much. Okay, he said to go fishing, right? Yeah. Do a little fishing. Also, like, since I've started posting clips on a separate Twitter account, like, I only use hashtags on that account, primarily. And I get a lot of, like, artists following me, which is cool. But, like, when they DM me, be like, hey, I can make stuff for you. It's like, eh. I don't feel special, because you're probably messaging that to, like, a million people every day, so. Make me feel special if you're gonna DM me, okay, guys? Don't DM me. <laughs> I'm not- <laughs> I won't always talk to people, because I'm very, like, I guess introverted and reclusive. So. Also, no parasocial Andes in chat. You can gift me subs, give me money, but I will not be your friend. Ludwig, I am not your friend. Um. Okay. So, I think it said I have to catch 10 fish, right? Yeah, 
ten. Oh wait. Oh, I caught a tire on the first one. That's why I was like, I, I know I caught two. Yeah, that's why. Like, I'm sus by. I haven't gotten like many DMs. It's usually just bots, which I ignore. And not that I have enough clout for people to message me anyway, so I'm not too concerned. Red snapper. Oh my god. I love fish so much. My mom hates the smell of fish, but I love it. Like, if I could eat fish every day, I would be happy. But since she doesn't like the smell, she doesn't allow me to make it at home unless she's out for the day. Like, any time my parents go on, like, a weekend trip, I make fish for my sister and I. And just cross my fingers that the smell is gone by the time they get home. <laughs> I was so excited when they added a cooking mechanic to the game. Like, I played a little bit of it before I deleted my island. <laughs> and it was really fun. Oh, I fucked up! <laughs> Oops. Because I think the theme I want for this island is to make it, like, a resort, I guess? I kind of want to make it a spot for, like, a destination wedding. Where it's just attractions and, like, restaurants. That's kind of, like, the theme I want for this island. Oh, I should probably get more sticks so I can make a net as well. Oh, and then get all the apples, that way I can sell them. I was so excited for today. Like, I didn't sleep well last night. <laughs> Like, I knocked out pretty early, and by early, I mean like 10 instead of midnight, but I kept waking up throughout the night. Wait, I- okay, I had a planned bit. I forgot it, frick. So, I also prepped, um, since Aurora, I killed my wife. This is my tribute to her. We are gonna have this, rest in peace Aurora, on screen. Just, just to remember her in a positive light. Because she was my wife, the love of my life, and... Along with everyone else on the island. She died, or I killed her, rather. <laughs> yeah, can I get some sages in chat for Aurora? <laughs> What time is it for you, Vora? Did you say you were on the East Coast? I think it was? Because last time I talked to you, I think you said you had, like, a third shift job. Or second shift, rather. East Coast? Yeah, I remember some stuff. <laughs> Easy. Best fisherman in the whole town. Got two, four, seven. Three more. I've never gone fishing because it seems boring, RL. I've also never scaled a fish, so I don't know how to like cut it or anything. I also find it unrealistic how I can't just, like, walk through the river. Like, come on. People go in the river to have fun. Like, why can't I just walk through the river? Be like the Oregon Trail. Just tread across it and hope for the best. Oh my god, seeing all these clams is teasing me so much. 
Like, I don't know how to make a shovel yet. Oh! <laughs> Just late reaction to that. Oh, frick. Gotta make another one. Give me some sticks. <laughs> Infinite stick glitch. <laughs> okay, I think we've tapped enough sticks out of that one. Aurora emote <laughs> when? Maybe. <laughs> Just to commem commemorate her. Ah, come on, no sticks! Okay, let's see what we got. We got nine sticks, we need one more. Ah, we hit the jackpot! Okay, three's good for now. Can get more later. Oh, without the snow, the screen is, like, way too bright for me. <laughs> I have, like, blue, like, tint on my glasses, but I honestly can't tell the difference. Oh, I was supposed to give him a fish. Is that what I was supposed to do? I just skipped through it. <laughs> oh, but a catch! I do believe this is a bitterling. Um, if this island can support a bitterling, why, who knows what other fantastic creatures we might find living here? I have an idea. An old friend of mine runs a museum, and I'd love to send it to him for a closer look. Would you be okay with that? Sure, why not? Thank you. I promise I'll take good care of your bitterling. Oh, that reminds me. This is in no way tied to your generous donation just now, but I have a useful app to show you. I sent you the Critterpedia app. It's a terrific resource for an aspiring island researcher just or such as yourself. With this one app, you'll get all the important details about the bugs, fish, and sea creatures you catch. I do hope you'll continue to fill it with your discoveries and share them with me too. I'm sure I'll be able to come up with some additional... kind of additional reward, huh? Can I make a net, though? <clears throat> oh, okay, I, I can. We also need a new fishing rod. I broke it already. I got angry because I missed that one fish and I just threw it. I'm joking, I do not have anger issues. <laughs> oh, welcome, welcome. You don't waste any time, do you? <laughs> I think I'm gonna do the Mickey laugh anytime they say it. We're still setting up, but for starters, we intend to offer a small selection of goods for our island residents. Space is limited right now, but we'll try to have some fresh stock each and every day. I'm sure you're busy, but feel free to take a look at some of the items we're thinking of selling. Well, I can't sell stuff yet? Uh, nah, I, I literally have no money, so... <laughs> Oh, he literally is just now saying he'll buy stuff. <laughs> Getting too ahead of myself. Yeah. We're not just sellers. We'll also buy things from you, including stuff gathered on this island. And because we want to support efforts to beautify the island, we'll even pay you a little bit in return for any weeds or trash you can bring in. If you want to know whether we'll buy something, just ask. Take my fish. Thank you. 
9k, sure! Oh, before I forget, I wanted to tell you something about the fruit you just sold me. When you eat food like fruits, you'll find yourself energized with more power than you might have imagined. The fruit is honestly probably laced with something. <laughs> Does anyone share that with you? What I mean is, you could break open rocks or maybe even dig up a whole tree if you had the right to. Now, it's fine for you to sell me your fruit, but you should try eating it once in a while too. I wonder if you can, instead of paying off with 5k miles, you can just pay off the 49k. Like, is that an option? I usually put this in the bottom. Okay. Back to fishing. I should probably have my fishing rod in hand, huh? There we go. Nope, out of reach. Can't get that one. Oh, I should not put my tent in the corner. I'm such a dumbass. sure how like often I'll play Animal Crossing on stream. Maybe once a week like Stardew. Because to me Animal Crossing and then in turn Stardew Valley is mainly like just chatting. Because not too much happens in game. So it's very much like you rambling the whole time. Imagine not catching any fish. <laughs> Literally, we're all the fish. Break, it got away. I'm used to having, like, the directional pads to pull out tools, but we don't have that unlocked yet. too far away. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Whenever <laughs> the controller vibrates, I get scared. It's like for most games, unless it's necessary for the controls, I will turn off vibration. There's like no bugs either. I think the best season is summer. Cause that's when there's like sharks and so many bugs. But I'm honestly glad that I'm restarting the island now. That way I can get all the like monthly creatures and bugs. So it's kind of nice that the timing worked out in this way. Yeah, chat, go get some water. Get a snack. In celebration for today, I was gonna like buy some cupcakes and do a bit where like I faked, like you know how you sing happy birthday? Like do a bit like that, but then I thought about it. And like I was gonna go buy some cupcakes, but they were way too expensive. Cause like if I'm gonna treat myself, I wanna get like nice food. I don't wanna get like kind of meh cupcakes from Walmart or something with like the super fake, super sweet icing. I don't like that. Like, the bakery that's near my house, the cupcakes, they start at like three bucks. So it's like, no shot. Because, like, if I'm gonna go out to buy something, I'm not gonna buy just one. I'm gonna buy one for like today and tomorrow. <clears throat> but it's like three bucks for a cupcake? That's a bit much. Oh, I fucked up! Oh, I used all my F words for the day. Rip. But one. <laughs> for the F-word counter for the day. Right there, come on. Easy. And I don't know about y'all, but whenever I eat a cupcake, 
I will. <laughs> it's bad. So like, if it's like this, I will like bite off the frosting, like the top of the cupcake first, and then I'll eat the cake part. Cause like it's it's so messy to like just bite straight through the center. Easy. I don't like how there's not a lot of bugs spawning right now. I mean, it is true to life. I know dr <gasps> big fish. I know during the winter months we don't have ants in our house, which is kind of cool. Oh, it's not a big, big fish. The flounder's pretty good, though. I love how all the names are puns. Even if they don't make sense, they're still good and fun. I just want to learn how to make a freaking shovel. So I can make bait and not have to run around all day. <clears throat> I know the first few days in game are kind of like slow. And excruciatingly painful. But the grind is fun to me. Fish. Come on. Surprised the rod hasn't broken yet. Dang it, I wanted to break after that one. You know, comedy. I'm gonna say it every time until it breaks now. That way I can clip it. <laughs> Called comedy. Content brain. Scared the bug away. Ah, <laughs> oh, I didn't know it was going to break. <laughs> Dumb bit. Uh, how much time did I invest? When I last checked, right before I deleted it, I had 660 hours. So, a lot. <laughs> if you watch the start of the VOD back, there's like a mini tour, but my island was not the prettiest. Like, she was alright, but I could have invested more time in decorating. Oh, I need more sticks. I go hunting for sticks again. Okay, let's find out what our object objective was, because I forgot. <laughs> what should I do? Yes, what should I do? I need direction. Yes, that is the question. Well, this island is a diverse habitat for many interesting creatures, you know? Other than us. <laughs> yes, you can catch all kinds of in insects and fish if you practice with your net and fishing rod. I'd be most curious to see what creatures you do catch them. Oh, do I have to give them what I catch? God damn it. This is what happens when you don't listen, guys. When you don't pay attention to class. And literally just sold all the fish and bugs I caught. Oh! <gasps> Get some more sticks so we can fish. And then we can get bugs. Oh, because I think the first thing we have to do is get him to get blathers? The owl dude to come to town. I forgot his name. I'm not into the lore <laughs> so much. 
Yeah, good one, Megan. Thank you, Vora. <laughs> I'm pro gamer here. Imagine being a streamer and not knowing how to play the game. Oh my god, give me some sticks! Any of you guys eat dirt or sticks when you were a kid? Or was it just me? <laughs> oh! Bug! Just you. <laughs> there it is. Oh, come on. There we go. Easy. You ate dust? Okay, I think dust is weird. It's like... When you're outside, you like play in the dirt and you accidentally eat dirt and then you sometimes try it for fun. But like eating dust, I think that's kind of sus. That is a little weird. Oh, there's a big fish, but I can't get it. Okay, let's go make a new rod. <laughs> Why are you cocking your eyebrow at me? I think eating... Okay. Let's see if I can actually run a pole now. I think I can run poles. Oh, uh, no. I can't do it. I freaked up. One day I will figure out how to do polls. <laughs> it was weird, yeah. Okay, at least you're aware. <laughs> um, later- oh, why am I talking to him? Later when we're playing Mario Kart, if anybody has grinded enough channel points in today's stream, because I know today was the first one where you could earn channel points, I will be doing predictions for every game. So, look forward to that, to the channel point gambas. I'm gonna make two fishing rods. That way I don't have to come back here every five minutes. Okay. <clears throat> My goal is to just, I guess, donate enough creatures to him. That way I can unlock the museum soon. And then Mario Kart time. I honestly really want to play Mario Kart right now. <laughs> I'm like itching to play it. <laughs> Wait, you saying I'm playing like you do? So you think I'm also playing wrong? What do you mean, fairy? Explain. Explain, please. Big fish. Hey chat, be quiet. Do not distract me. Got it. Easy, easy clap. <laughs> oh, another bass. <laughs> I love seeing ellipses in chat. It's so funny. We need more like emote spammers in chat. That's what I want. I want more chatters like Vora. You guys. Make it so happy. <laughs> oh, play the game again, fairy. Like, it's pretty chill. Because when I was, like, into into it, I would play, like, one or two hours a day. But I think I'll play, like, a little bit every day. Not always on stream. Um, a thing that I was thinking about last night is since I have affiliate, I don't necessarily need to have like my average viewership as like my main concern so i'm thinking about changing up the format in terms of maybe doing one or two games a day because my focus is going to be or my main focus rather is being able to talk whole stream without getting or like without worrying myself out mentally because on the days where i do like a stardew valley stream where i'm trying to talk the whole time I find that I'm just, like, emotionally and, like, mentally exhausted more so after than a Mario Kart stream. So I think I just need to do more streams where I'm 
continuously talking more, that way you get used to it. Like, I watch people who stream for like five to eight hours every day and they're like talking the whole time, like talking about new stuff every day. And it's like, how, how do you do that? Like, teach me. So, I either will do like one game a day for one and a half to three hours, depending on the game. Or do like two games for one stream, but like one and a half hours for each game. So, we're gonna see how it goes. Practice helps? Yeah, for sure. Like, it, it definitely took a while. Because I started streaming back in June to like get over the hump of like being comfortable on cam. Definitely changing my camera angle helped. Because before, it was on top of my dresser, and it was like maybe five feet up from where my eye level is. So it definitely felt like this- oh, I freaked up. Definitely felt like I was disassociating myself from cam. But now it's a bit closer to me. It's a bit more at eye level, so like I can actually look over and not have to like tilt up and look at you guys. So, doing little things like that definitely helped me get used to being on cam and more comfortable. I think also having like- People in chat definitely helps. Like, even if, like, someone is lurking. Like, if you just, like, say something every five minutes, just knowing that, like, people are genuinely here. Um, not to complain about having zero viewers, but it sucks when you don't have many people. Because, like, it's hard to feel like what you're doing is validating, I guess. Not to, like, be critical or, or like, concerning myself about not having people watching or engaging. Like, that's fine. There will be, like, off days. But... I just need to not look at viewer count too much. Because I feel like I have this primarily the same amount of energy if I have, like, one person in chat versus, like, five. I think the most I've had off and on in chat one day was, I think my achievement said, like, six. Which is really cool. Like, that's pretty fog. Um... But I just need to get over, like, that mental hurdle, I guess. Yeah, I agree. Like, transitioning, like, your mentality between, like, being on and, like, being off, I guess, definitely does wear me out a little bit. Like, on the days where I do stream... Um, because my current schedule is probably gonna stay at three days a week. But after stream, I usually have to, like, chill for an hour or two. Like, I would, like, watch a video or, like, listen to music for a little bit just to, like, calm down, I guess. And it's fun- funny because my dad, he works for himself, so he doesn't necessarily have to leave the house- <gasps> Big fish! <laughs> he doesn't necessarily have to leave the house every day, so sometimes when I end stream, I, like, go out to the living room and I'm like, Hey, Dad, this is how it went today! And he's like, oh, that's great! Um, so, like, I definitely feel nice after, like, I talk to him for a little bit. Um, but on days where, like, he's at work, I'm like, ah, I don't have someone to, like, congratulate me. <laughs> and that's what, like, the days where I, like, those are the days where, like, I need to, like, I guess, let myself down easy. Like, either, like, watch vids or listen to music to, like, calm down a little. Because <clears throat> I, myself, I'm very, like, reserved, um, in general. I'm not too close to my family. I'm speaking softer because my dad is home. Um... But it's still nice to have, like, someone in the house to, like, talk to. Hi, Rex! Thank you for coming in to chat and saying hi. <laughs> you were gifted a sub from Fairy, so you were so lucky, Rex. Like, you lucked out, man. Um, But yeah, we're working on... Earlier, I had a little PowerPoint talking about what emotes chat would like or what emotes I personally like. Oh, I messed up. Um... But hopefully I will have emotes made before people sub before people who sub today, they should have emotes by within a month, is what I'll say. Um there, as I said earlier, the reason why I didn't want to launch with emotes is I kinda want like chat to decide or like what current subs what they would like to see in emotes. Because to me, emotes are the main reason why I subscribe to people. But yeah. So if any any subs or any chatters have suggestions on like what emotes will make you want to sub, throw them in chat. That way I have an idea. Hope we're doing well. Yeah, I'm doing really good. 
it's nice to see you in chat. I know I see you in <laughs> um, Rainy's chat all the time, and it's so funny reading your messages, Rex, because, like, I know you're trolling, and I know you're, like, memeing. <laughs> but you spam caps stuff a lot, and it's really funny to read. Because, like, I feel like my, my chat style is very similar to yours, Rex, but, like, I'm a bit more toned down. But, yeah, I'm doing good. Today's been a good day. Oh, okay, one thing that did irk me was I did not get um, cupcakes because the cupcakes were a bit too expensive. So to treat myself, I got Chick-fil-A. And by that, I mean I got delivery because imagine going out to buy your food when like DoorDash and Uber is a thing. So I got like so much food. Because <laughs> you know how when you're hungry, you inherently want to like buy more food. <laughs> Hi, welcome to chat, Austin. Hello. I assume if you have any preferred names or pronouns, tell me. That way I'm aware. But I'll call you Austin for now. But thank you for coming in chat. Um, what was I gonna say? Okay, so I ordered like a lot of food. <laughs> oh, your friend. Oh, really? Yeah, D Downs was my first sub. Shout out, Downs. But cool. I'm glad we're getting people from other chatters coming in. But that's nice. Um, yeah, thank you. Um, what was I saying? So, like, I bought too much food. I basically bought breakfast, lunch, and dinner for me today. <laughs> and by that, I mean way too many hip breakfast sandwiches. So, every single time I order delivery, there's always something missing from my ticket. Hey! Thank you for the prime sub, Austin Attack. Thank you! Um, we're getting emotes set up soon. <coughs> so... If you have any suggestions, subscribers, suggest an emote, and we'll hopefully have some made by the end of the month. Oh, I'm out of stuff, huh? We're gonna let this one go. Okay, let's go donate some fish. Anyway, anytime I order delivery, there's always something missing from the ticket. Like, I think I ordered three sandwiches, <laughs> hash brown, like an eight-piece nugget, and like a coffee. And I opened the bag, and it looks like everything was in there. I'm like, okay, good. They actually didn't frick up my order. But, like, I opened everything up, and they were missing the nuggets, and I was sad. Because Chick-fil-A nuggets are so expensive. They're, like, $1.25 each. So, like, it's, like, of all the things, why forget the most expensive thing from the ticket? Ugh, it's annoying. But thank God I got credit, because I'd be so annoyed. <laughs> like, come on. <laughs> I know, how can they forget the nuggets? The most essential part of the order. Like, how? <laughs> um, let's see. I don't like spicy. Even mild sauce, like, triggers me. Sometimes. I can't handle it. Hey, thank you for the follow, Austin. Yeah, imagine subbing but not following. <laughs> imagine. <laughs> What? Yeah, I, don't, I can't handle spicy. Like, I can't do it. Like, some people say, oh, I eat spicy food for fun. But, like, you're just a masochist. It's not fun. Like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> hey, thank you for the follow, Chris and me. Chris, Chris Mai. If you have any preferred names or pronouns, tell me in chat. You eat ghost peppers for fun? You're Something's wrong with you, Rex. Like, something is seriously wrong with you. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Has the superior bugs? What? What are you talking about, fairy? I know, like, fast food restaurants aren't the cleanest, but... They had bugs in their food? Question mark? Oh, I, 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 have been, I have been reading chat and not reading the dialogue. So I was not paying attention to what he said. <laughs> okay. That reminds me. I've been meaning to share more DIY recipes with you. Okay, he's gonna teach me how to make an axe. Cool. I know, um, Austin, you asked me what are my OG villagers. Earlier in stream, we deleted my old island. So, I totally didn't cry when I had to kill Aurora. That's why we have the RIP Aurora overlay on screen in remembrance of her. So, she is my, hands down, my wife, my queen. Um, <laughs> so she is my favorite. Yeah, Sages and F's in chats for Tiblin. 
I can think of something else made from wood. Ha! Anyway, <laughs> PG-13 chat. It's called comedy. Okay. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> um. Oh, I have to give him more creatures. I think I have to give him three, right? Ayo, jokes. I got jokes. I've said it before, but like my humor is normally very raunchy and vulgar. I just turn it off for stream because I know there's sometimes kids watching. <laughs> you know, Rex, you know what I'm talking about. You, you get the joke. I don't have to say it. Nobody else has to say it, but you all know. You know. If you know, you know, okay? <laughs> Like, I've thought about writing, like, stand-up bits. Not to perform them, but just to be, like, a ghostwriter for someone. But it's too scary. <laughs> Kappa. Yeah, you're capping. <laughs> oh, okay. I've given you some red pansy bags. Just a little sampling of our product we sell. Go ahead and do some planting, and after a few days you'll have beautiful blooming flowers. Anyway, give it a whirl. And if you enjoy gardening, stop by and buy more. Lurkin, cool. Appreciate the lurk. Thank you for coming into chat. Rex. We love lurkers. <clears throat> um, let's see. I hope you'll keep bringing me new discoveries to examine. It's all part of an island experience. Okay, I assume I gotta give him more stuff. Another creature? <laughs> Mickey laugh is so funny. Uh, another creature. Well, let's have a look at that one as well. <clears throat> let's give him a bug. A stinky bug. Hey! Thank you for the follow, Kate Zane. I appreciate it. Oh, another friend of Downs? Imagine. Oh. But thank you for coming to chat. If you have any preferred names or pronouns, tell me. For now, I'll call you Kate. Unless you don't like that. Like your top, thank you. It's from Fred Meyer. It was on sale for $20. And it's a bit too tight because I gained weight. <laughs> but thank you. Um, Yeah, okay, I gave him... The dragonfly, I cannot talk. My pronouns are she, her. Yeah, only time I will buy clothes is if it's on sale. Like, I got a nice Levi jacket. I'm just skipping through all this dialogue. Like, I know how to plant freaking flowers. Anyway, like, I got a nice, like, tan Levi jacket with, like, kind of, like, the down collar. It was regular price $100, but I got it on sale for $50, so... Shout out to me. <laughs> Skip his dialogue, because it's worst. It's kind of alright. Like, I know there's a, a lot of dialogue in the beginning. But we'll, we'll push through it. <clears throat> Oh, he gave me a, a watering can, right? I have such ADD brain where, like, whenever- If I don't see something aloud, it doesn't register sometimes. Like, when I read a book, I have to read it to myself, like, quietly. For it to process. Oh, I thought he gave me a watering can! Need a shower? Yeah, no problem. Thank you for coming to chat, Vora. Appreciate you memeing as always, but hope you have a good one. <laughs> yeah, Tom Nook is kind of sus, guys. <laughs> I think, you know during the intro cutscene how they call Tom Nook our supreme leader? It's like, um, okay. <laughs> sure. Yeah, just wash yourself of all of Tom Nook's icky germs. <laughs> okay, I think he gave me the DIY recipe for the watering can. I did not mean to click on that. Okay, he gave me the DIY. So, soft wood. Wait. I need to make an axe. Okay, so we need branches and stone. Ooh, money tree? <clears throat> I 
Ooh, a lot of branches. Okay. And then... Wait, can I make a... I keep pressing the wrong button. I cannot make... Oh, I can't make an axe. I can't make a shovel yet. I really want that shovel. You want to eat the trees? And y'all made fun of me for eating dirt and sticks earlier. And then now Fairy's saying she wants to eat trees. <laughs> Imagine teasing the streamer when you were yourself. <laughs> Admits that they want to eat the trees. Oh, I can still give him creatures! <laughs> yeah, I would have to say, like, mashed potatoes and cones. I was gonna say more like cotton candy, but okay. <laughs> I don't know why it keeps catching LMFAO. Like, I permitted that last week, so I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Mods? <laughs> Mod check. Oh, okay, we got Blathers. Blathers, is that you? Oh, what a splendid timing. <laughs> the Mickey laugh is so funny to me. When I used to babysit, I would jokingly do the Mickey laugh so many times, and she would just die laughing every time. It's like anytime she was sad, I would pull a, oh, and she would just get out of her sad mood. It was like my trump card. <clears throat> okay. Yes, yes. Do you remember the venture we discussed? Well, it's come to fruition. I'm currently stationed on an island that we've decided to call Tibland. Yes, the local fauna are as abundant as expected, just as I told you. Hmm. Precisely. How many precisely, you ask? Well, there's no way of knowing just yet. But I have received, let's see, five outstanding specimens so far. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. What? Seriously? Well, that is very exciting. Oh, but you'll have to excuse me. I'm with a customer right now. <laughs> me at work. <laughs> hey, thank you for the follow. Sepapone Alexis. Okay. If you have any preferred names or pronouns, tell me in chat. <clears throat> yeah, I do find all my chatters funny and hilarious. But, Kate, you are extremely funny. <laughs> I love doing, like, the fake ego personality. It's so funny to me. So if it's too much, tell me, guys, okay? <clears throat> Ooh, you're on the southern hemisphere? Maybe not right now, because I don't have my friend code public. Maybe in the future. Alexis? Okay, cool. I will call you Alexis. Yes, I know I'm nice and kind. Thank you. <laughs> I- Okay. I'm usually, like, super anxious and, like, nervous, but I think, like I said, doing the ego is so funny to me. Like, I, I'm a switch, so, like, I can switch between, like, being super, like, nervous and then super ego. Anyway, back to game. Okay. So I'm sorry to keep you waiting. That was my friend Blathers, the one who curates a museum. Believe it or not, he's going to come to our island to help us identify and preserve the local creatures. Ah, that's cool, that's cool. But I could use your help. Oh my god. Oh, okay, I just have to place it. I was like, I, f I caught so many fish, so many bugs for you. Like, this is exploiting free labor, but I do owe you money, so this could be indentured servitude. I don't know. Anyway. <laughs> Since you've done so much scouting and collecting already, would you be able to help find a spot for Blathers? We'll need a good-sized space to really build out a world-class museum, so do keep that in mind. This is his guiding. Oh. <laughs> I cannot talk. This is exciting. It's all coming together. <clears throat> okay, so I need to place the museum. And then I assume I'm done for today's tasks. I think. I assume. I I just want to play Mario Kart, please. Let, let's, let this be all I have to do. Like, just let me play Mario Kart. We're putting it here. <laughs> Yeah, this is it. I don't care. Right in town. <clears throat> okay. Place the tent. Let's hope Tom Nook is happy. Ooh, 
Cutscene. Ah, <coughs> oh, Megan. I take it you found a suitable spot for blathers to set up, huh? I did. It's good. Good enough. I knew it could count on you. Thank you. I'll let Blathers know that he can move in as soon as he wants. In any case, you just got here, so I'd hate to see you push yourself too far on day one. Yes, we're done! <laughs> Murray card time! <laughs> oh, but it's no far off my nose if you want to rack up those Nook Mouse to pay me back quickly. I've got a few tips for racking up old Nook Mouse, so don't hesitate to ask if you need a little advice. Okay. Okay. Murray card time! <laughs> This Animal Crossing segment went longer than I thought it would. <laughs> Let's be honest. Okay. Let's see what we have. Okay, I'm gonna sell everything in my inventory because we can always recatch it later. I I wanted to be nice and not shove him out of the way. Like it's not Black Friday. I should not be assaulting people at the store. <clears throat> Okay, let's sell our junk. Get those good bells. Yeah, I'm I'm so excited. Like my leg is sh shaking right now. <laughs> I'm like ready for Mario Kart, please. Okay. Not that I don't like Animal Crossing. I love Animal Crossing, but like I just want something a bit more hyped right now. <clears throat> I'm still riding off that sugar high from my coffee this morning. Okay, okay. Let's save here. Okay. That was good. So now we have Blathers probably coming into town tomorrow. And I'll set up for the rest of the first few days in game. Okay. So let's switch gears. I'm gonna put my hair up because now we're going into like real gaming. <clears throat> Gamer mode activate. Okay. <clears throat> Since we've been live for quite a while, I would highly recommend that everybody get some water, get a snack if you need it. Because it'll take me a solid 30 seconds to change out my game card. So, get a snack. I'm probably gonna munch in something really quick, too. <clears throat> okay, Mario Kart time. Let's hope the game works, because I've been having an issue where I put new cartridges in, and it won't work. Um, yeah. Okay. <clears throat> okay, she works, we're good. Oh. Ooh, too loud. Mario Kart eight! Oh, I- <laughs> I put it on game cam. Just keep it on base candle time. It rest in peace, Aurora. But you know we're gonna turn that overlay off because we're not playing Animal Crossing anymore. Okay, so plan for today with Mario Kart. Um, I'm going to change the title real quick. One second. I swear I'm prepared. <laughs> okay. okay. Wario? Okay, got it. I will- Why'd you choose Wario? I told you last time I hate heavy characters, but for you, Fairy, I will do it. <clears throat> oh. Okay, well, I'm, I'm changing my title. I don't have mods. I'm changing my title. Playing Mario Kart, not Animal Crossing anymore. Oh. <laughs> I'm yeah, I must, I must listen to you. Okay, I have changed the titles. Wait, for I, okay. 
One second, I gotta add one more command. I wish I could put infinite characters in the title. Cause you know how whenever you look at an XQC stream, his titles are just insanely obscure in like... <clears throat> over the top long. Okay, so exclamation rules in chat. What we are doing for this challenge is if I do not get first place, I will give chat subs from the- <laughs> from- <laughs> I had scripted this out, but I fucked up. F word number two. We did a F word counter in chat. Okay, rules are simple. I will be playing two Kree's. If I do not get first, I will give chat subs because I am nice and I asked my dad to loan me money for today. So, theoretically, I can gift up to eight subs Hey, will we be playing 200 CC? Because I am fairly decent at 100. I'm- If you look, I have a lot of gold trophies in 200. I have gold in all of the pre's. But! I do not have all 3 star gold trophies. Because in order to get a 3 star gold trophy, you need to get first in all 4 pre's. So! I can either do really well today. Or! Club and gift chat subs. So! I am hoping for the- <laughs> That I don't have to give too many, but we will see. Okay, I chose Wario because Fairy wanted to be mean and give me a heavy character. Oh, frick, I hate this. As long as it doesn't slow me down too much. Okay, so to make it fair, I will choose a track that I do not have a lot of stars in. Hey, thank you for the sub, Kate. I appreciate it. Emotes are coming soon, so look forward to that. Um, okay. So... <clears throat> oh, you- Okay, does someone want to choose which pre I have to do? I will let chat choose the first pre. You guys have 30 seconds to choose a pre. You can either choose a pre that I'm good at, like Mushroom Cup, or... Choose a pre that I'm not good at, like Special. Slow down. <laughs> okay. I will read everything off for Fairy. We have Mushroom Cup. Hands down the easiest track. All the lines are fairly simple in this one. <laughs> Shell Cup, another fairly easy one. The only one I have trouble with is Toad's Turnpike. Because you do have a lot more vehicles to avoid. But another easy one. As you can see, I do have three stars in this one. So, if y'all want subs, don't pick this one. Banana Cup. I like Roll Raceway and DK Jungle. You vote that one? Which one that one? The Shell Cup Fairy? Anyway. <clears throat> Banana Cup. I like the two last tracks. Lines are fairly good. I like the skips and DK Jungle. Dry Dry Desert, I'm never good at. Never good at. Oh, you want this one? Okay. If you want Shell Cup, we'll do Shell Cup for Fairy. She got to pick the character and the cup. Okay. I will do this one first. Chat, have any suggestions for the second pre? I'll read through the rest of them. That way you guys have an idea. Flower Cup. Lines aren't too hard in this one. Mario Circuit, Toad Harbor. Lines are fairly simple. Twisted Mansion and Shy Guys, since they do have, like, inverted um, cars, they are a bit more difficult. Lines and Shy Guy isn't that bad, but it's hard to stay ahead on that one. Star Cup. I hate this cup. If you want subs, choose this one. I hate Mount Wario. I'm not good at the tree section. The other tracks I'm fairly decent at, but I'm still not a fan of this cup. Thief Cup. I hate any Wario stage. I hate any Wario stage. So, if you hate me, pick the Leaf Cup. <laughs> um, the other three courses aren't that bad. They aren't that bad. Sherbert Land is fun. I hate Sherbert Land. It's. Uh uh, Lightning Cup. I think Lightning Cup is one of my favorite courses. Mainly because these courses aren't that hard. They all have like longer drifts. Like there's a couple of parts in Piranha Plant Slide and Rainbow Road that have like nice, longer, satisfying drifts. Definitely one of my favorites. Special Cup. This one, I think, is the most difficult one. It does have the Rainbow Road without guardrails. That one is sucky. Bone Dry, I'm not good at. Bowser Castle's lines are a bit more difficult. 
Oh, Rex? Oh, Rex knows this one. Yeah, when we do next free, you guys tell me which one you want to play next. This is just an overview so we don't have to do this again. Um... <laughs> Make a redemption where I talk with Mario. I'd have to practice my impression. So maybe... <laughs> I can do Mickey laugh. Okay. Egg Cup. It is very hard to consistently get first an Excite Bike, similar to Baby Park. Mainly focus on what items you get. But overall, I'm fairly decent at this cup. Even though I do not have a 3-star, I'm fairly decent at all these tracks. Triforce Cup. The lines in Rainbow Road and Ice Ice Outpost are fairly difficult to learn. It's also very difficult to learn the skips in Ice Ice Outpost. But I do love Wario's Goldmine Stage. That is one of my favorites. I played it all the time on the Wii. Definitely one of my top 5. Um, so if you kind of like me but kind of hate me, choose this one for next round. Bell Cup. I love all the stages in this pre, except for Super Bell Subway. Kind of like Toad's Turnpike. I hate having to not have to hit the trains. <laughs> so this one is all right. Big Blue is really fun to do. But yeah. Crossing Cup. I think I like Animal Crossing and Wild Woods. Those are definitely in my top five as well. But Cheeseland, not fun. Mainly because I don't like the color yellow. And Baby Park, it's also difficult to get first in because similar to Excite Bike, you have to focus on items. Okay. We already decided on doing Shell Cup first for our first pre. But keep in mind, if you have any suggestions for our second pre, just have it in the back of your mind. Keep it, copy and paste it in chat, and we'll do it later. Okay. Since you guys were nice, we're doing Shell Cup. I do have three Star Go Trophy in this one, so therefore... I am able to potentially get first in all four and not have to gift any subs. Easy, easy clap. Okay, since this is regular comms, um, I just have to make sure my lines are fairly decent to make sure I stay in first consistently. Because even though, um, even though you get worse items if you're in first, it's a lot better than having to be in the center where items will spawn. Oh, I should have held that red. Anyway, it'll be a lot easier than trying to combat all the different items that people near the back will have. Oh, I'm so not used to playing a heavy character. I hate this. Whoever made me pick Wario... Oh, banned. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <clears throat> I'm surprised anyone has 500 points at this... at this point. Because I've only... Oh, <laughs> I guess I can. I have a ban button right here, dude. Oh no. Oh, uh oh. Oh no. <laughs> okay, maybe me saying I have to get first was asking too much. I'm playing like this is 150, but I keep forgetting this is 200. Oh, easy. I didn't even aim. Back in second, easy. Oh, I'm, he's way too heavy. I'm not used to this at all. Because it seems like his turns drag a lot more. Worst item in the game. Why, why give me a coin? Give me something good. Easy. But I tell you guys, this is my best cup. Okay. So I do have a text overlay so people coming in will, will know which if I've gotten first or not. So we've gotten one first on the board. Easy, easy clap. Y'all are getting no subs. Okay. <laughs> yes, all bodies are beautiful. Why are you so good? Have you never seen one of my Mario Kart streams? I'm actually so good at this game. I'm training for pro. Just kidding. I would <laughs> I would not too good in a pro match. This is against computers, that's why I look like I'm doing well, but in online matches, I suck at us. Like, if I play, for example, 20 matches of online, I get first maybe one time. Second, maybe twice. It's mainly because the lobby making in online is not the best, so like, they'll pair up people with 1k points randomly with someone with 20k. So, online is not the best if you're learning. So I recommend to anybody who's learning how to do lines, do tricks and stuff properly, definitely practice with um, computers first. 
because online can be very overwhelming and frustrating. Oh my god, how have I not hit him? Literally, okay, there we got him. <laughs> yeah, I do not like playing with Wario. This is not fun. Okay, back in first, easy. We just have to hold for literally oh my God, a whole lap. I know it's best to play with cards in 200 because the other day someone told me um, in comments that if I'm struggling with 200, you should practice with cards that are a bit slower. Ah! <laughs> that way it's easier to do your lines properly. But in my head, faster car, better driver. <gasps> Frick. Oh no, oh oh, oh no. <laughs> uh oh. This is not looking good. But see, like, since my bike is faster, I'm able to catch up easily if I fall behind. Taking the hold. Cross her fingers, she doesn't cut me off. Easy. Easy. Another first, baby. Okay, I should not be hyping myself up too much because this is one of the easier cups in the game. So... Keep in mind, if it looks like I'm nailing this pre, choose a really difficult pre for the second one. You know? Keep that in mind, chat. <laughs> okay, Cheap Cheap Beach. I love this course. It's very fun, very colorful. The lines are fairly simple. The only section I'm not that good at is the underwater section. Like, I still don't know what the best line is. Easy. He didn't use his banana in time. Pro tip, if you hold your coin and wait to use it, a second coin will not spawn in your item box. I say that every time on stream, but some people who are new might not know that trick. Where did I even hear that trick initially? Oh my god, I'm going too fast. Oh, what's your favorite map, Rex? I want to get a different item. Okay, we're gonna get screwed. Blue shell coming. That's literally nothing I can do. Okay, let's keep going. What was that line Mario did there? That was like the wackest line I've ever seen. Oh! <laughs> wrong way, wrong way! <sighs> okay, we're fine. Can easily catch up. No lot of problem. The thing I've been struggling with is drifting the wrong way. Because if you use your left stick, it determines which way you drift. Because there's certain tricks you can do to make yourself make yourself drift faster. Oh, I I'm literally going to lose because I'm playing Mario. <gasps> Did you guys see that? I I sniped her. <laughs> uh oh, oh no. Okay, see if we can cut here. Easy. No, no. Damn. Oh no. Okay, we got one second. So that means I owe chat one gifted sub. Damn. <laughs> of all the courses, I didn't think this one would get me. I did not think Chip Cheap would get me. Mm mm. Okay, so you guys get one sub. <laughs> I think I'm actually going to cap it at maybe 10, so I can afford to give 10. Okay. <laughs> Good evening. I didn't go for the other line. I'm going to hit a car. I'm literally going to hit a car. Okay, saved. I hate this part. I hate this part. 
<laughs> I'm also going to change my character every pre that I play. So if anybody wants to save their channel points for the next character, do so if you please. Otherwise, I'll probably choose Link or Isabel. That way I get a lighter character again. Oh! Yeah, I'm gonna snipe him right here. Oh, I should have held. Okay, not like it would have mattered because I would have lost both items from that lightning bolt. I hate having to dodge the cars. It's not fun. It's anxiety inducing. We're gonna hold. Cross our fingers, we don't get a blue shell. I mean, if we get a blue shell, I might be able to dodge it because I do have a shroom in my inventory, but I have not mastered that trick yet. So, still cross my fingers, we don't get a shroom. Got a huge lead. Unless I absolutely flip. Easy. E easy. Okay, one more set first on the board. Doing fairly decent. <coughs> okay. Now that we have the shell cup down, any suggestions for the next pre? Anybody? Are you, like, not into, like, Mario Kart at all, Rex? Like, there's, like, some people who grind and, like, practice for pro games. No, I'm talking about a pre. Pick a pre, Rex. I can choose the pre that has Bowser's Castle. I can do that. <laughs> Donkey Kong? Oh, another heavy character, guys. Come on. Fine. We we'll do Donkey Kong. And then the pre that has Bowser's castle. As requested by Rex and Downs. Let's see. Okay. 200 CC. Donkey Kong. I hate the heavy characters. I mean, it's whatever. I don't care. I nailed that cup with Wario, so. <laughs> oh, fuck. It's special cup. Third F word of the day. I can't do any more. No more F words. I did my third one. Ah, this is literally my worst cup. <sighs> Why did you guys choose this one? It's literally the worst one. Ah! This is my favorite. Are you even good at this game, Rex? Imagine. But this Rainbow Road sucks! It's literally the worst Rainbow Road in this game! <clears throat> oh yeah, I love playing as Toad too, because he's another light character. I stand the light characters. Okay, this trap won't be too hard. It's just a matter of not falling off. <laughs> Timing cannot be any better. This line is probably the hardest in this whole track, but I nailed it that time. Yeah, as I fall off, imagine. It's called comedy. I I, I threw for content again. Okay, there's a skip right here on that little leaf pad, but I never go for it because similar to Ribbon Road, the track is a little bit too small to nail every time. Oh, that line was horrible. I'm gonna- Ooh, dude, I dodged that blue shell. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I was gonna say I nailed that line, but then I got ramped at the end, so it literally doesn't matter. Yeah, 
Not like when daddy is fine, just not in like in a like inappropriate way, I guess. But I think it's kind of weird that you want to call Donkey Kong daddy. Let me just leave it at that. Oh no. How am I in fifth? This is not good. I need to catch up. <sighs> no, I can shame all I want. I'm the streamer, okay? Okay. Maybe this is karma for making fun of you, but I'm still in fifth. I have literally not caught up yet. Okay, we squish Bowser. Easy. Ram Daisy. <gasps> RNG is just in my favor today. No, I'm not gonna fall off here. Easy. Dude, I clutched at the end. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Oh, Rex just self-reporting in chat. <laughs> I like- I like the Rainbow Road Stages, I just don't like the one that's in this free because it's literally the hardest. Because the lines are way too curvy. It's very difficile. <clears throat> okay. I'm worried about this one. I'm rusty, I haven't- wait, I literally played Mario Kart last night. I was gonna say I haven't played in three days, but I played with my sister last night. For funsies. No! <laughs> I hate- I hate the lines in this track, they're so difficult. Not fun. Uh oh. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> I love when you guys meet with each other in chat. Like I just look over. And I'm like, oh, like let the kids talk talk amongst themselves. You know, it's so funny. <laughs> Come on. If I get anything less than third, I will cry on stream. Oh! Dang it. Imagine getting 12th against comms. I've only done that one time. We got protection, we're good, we just have to hold. Well, I got way better at that line. Not really. <laughs> oh, do we dodge that blue? Oh, literally the worst item I can get. Easy. Easy. Another first, guys. Y'all thought you can trip me up with this pre, but no. Easy. Easy. I'm just too good at this game. Count to the next. <clears throat> Imagine I get a three-star gold trophy on my worst pre. <laughs> Kappa. <laughs> I think it's kind of sus if you watch Twitch and you work for the FBI. I think that's a self-report. As requested, Bowser's Castle for Rex. Let's see if you can trip me up. Oh, I did the trick too early. How am I only in 
one second. Literally, where's first? I went down the wrong track. I usually- I should go down the left one. Okay, back in first. I was like, how am I only in second? Token? Oh my god, come on. I hate getting rammed. How am I still getting, like, rammed when I'm, like, a heavy character? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. You're going down the left path because left path is the best path. <laughs> I'm not used to doing this path, that's why I've loved. not my day, guys. It's not my day. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna shut up because I need to concentrate. I do not want to get to another sub. You guys deserve it, but... My tax return should be processed in a few days. <laughs> I'm only- okay, how I- literally how am I in fifth? Dang it! Y'all are getting another one. <laughs> Yeah, good job, Rex. You, you got me. You got me. Okay, at least I got a second. That's still pretty good. No three-star gold trophy for this one, but might be a two-star. If I can pull through and get first on the hardest rainbow road in the game. Yeah, you, you chose a good one, Rex. You got me. I'm down another five bucks. <laughs> This first line in the start is so difficult. Because the issue I have is I drift too early, so my speed. <gasps> frick! I, I said frick! <laughs> like, it's so hard to not fall off in the start. Okay, lines in that section were actually amazing. I'm good at this game. Both you. Come on. <laughs> yeah, I said bad word. No, 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 no. Okay, I didn't fall off that time, so that is improvement. Back in first, where I belong. <laughs> I'm actually getting better at this line. Imagine. Okay, I didn't. I did not fall off on purpose. I actually was trying. Come on. I did not belong in twelve. I know, I cannot have timed that fail better. Oh. <laughs> that first turn is always the most difficult in the whole game. It, cause like, I'm fairly decent at all the other lines in all the other tracks, but that one single turn trips me up every time. Oh my god, I'm in ninth, this is- oh. <laughs> No bueno. Blue shell? 
If I get 12, I'm ending stream. I'm literally gonna end stream if I get last. Banging his head against the handlebars. Oh, it's gonna be a silver trophy. Oh, dude. Mm -mm, mm -mm. <sighs> yeah, let's add a seventh to the board. I did not think I would do that bad. But we got a seventh. Okay. So we've done two pre's. Anybody have suggestions for a new player? Or a new pre. I can maybe do two more pre's. Because I said I'd cap myself at 10 subs. <laughs> now, if you just erase the top part of the 7, it's a 1. Okay? You're just reading it wrong. Oh, you need to see them? Okay, when we get to the loading screen, Rex, Rex has dibs. Okay, chat? Don't take their fire. Rex has dibs. <clears throat> oh, it's a stinky gold trophy. <laughs> oh dear! <laughs> yeah, I fell off. Okay, does the cutscene play after the special cup? Is that what triggers it? Because I couldn't figure it out, but that seems to be the pattern. Okay, choose Rex. If you want to be nice to me, choose a lighter character, please. <laughs> um Skeleton Bowser, okay. Oh, sorry, I did not mean to slam my cup. That was an accident. Another heavy character. Why do you do this to me guys? Okay, who wants to pick the next pre? I'm gonna leave it on this one because I like this one a lot, but you can choose another one. You just like Bowser? I don't think there's any other Bowser stages, but I guess Grumble Volcano would be the closest to a Bowser stage. You don't like it? Well, I like the spree. <laughs> you like the Haunted Mansion one? I think? Which pre is that? Actually, where is it? <laughs> oh, here it is. So this one, I like this break. We can do this one. Any rebuttals? Going once. Going twice. Sold to Flower Cup, let's go. Bad for you guys, but I'm really good at this pre. So let's see if y'all are gonna get more subs. What? Okay. I hate playing heavy characters so much. Okay, reverse psychology. I should just say I hate playing light characters, so that way you guys will choose light characters next time. Maybe that's the strat. <laughs> I could have dodged that one. I am so not used to playing heavy characters. I'm I'm good at this game, I swear. It's just I'm not used to having extra weight. Like it's it's subtle, but it's totally changing how your lines are. Oh my god! Like, it almost seems like it's harder to set up my drips. Because it's harder for him to turn and, like, lean. It, or maybe it's just in my head. But it just seems like it.
Get back in third. Second. First. Imagine. Okay, I just have to hold. Believers. Oh, I forgot to write predictions. <laughs> Oopsie. There we go, there we go. Easy. Okay. I totally forgot that predictions were a thing. Okay, so I think for predictions, if we're gonna do pre's, we're gonna do... Oh, Megan, get gold. If anyone is unfamiliar with how predictions work, is... Oh, let's see. Did it run? There it goes. Okay. So you can gamble your channel points for whichever prediction wins. And then the final outcome, you, you basically take from the pool. <clears throat> it's really fun. <gasps> who said no? Who said no? Who said no? Tell me who said no. Okay, you guys are gambling against me. Freak, you guys. Okay, gold trophy is if you get first overall for the pre. So whoever voted no, that is literally the wrong decision. You saw me get one gold and one silver already, so why would you vote for me to not get gold? Your loss, okay? <laughs> Sad, I don't have any believers. Come on. It's okay, I'm gonna get gold just to spite my doubters, okay? for the tight line but I loved I was trying to look cool for you guys but I failed okay, let's go for a cut here easy Dylan first BB yeah his drifts don't seem as smooth as a lighter character I can do to protect myself. We well, got Starbies? What'd you get? I haven't had Starbucks in so long. I will always get one of the fruit juices because, like, I'm not too big a fan of coffee, but I love the dragon fruit juice they have. It's my favorite. Okay, still in first. Easy. Doubters, get screwed. <laughs> Ooh, that sounds good. Oh, y'all see that? I dodged that green shell DK through behind him. I'm pro gamer here. Okay, we're gonna hold the coin and hope so we get a better item. Game. Easy, another first. Okay. <clears throat> On to the next race. Whew. Chat, drink water. It's been about another hour. There's only a few lines that I'm not as good at in this track. Because the lines that are like square shaped or I call them Z shaped are definitely a lot harder to drift. Oh, we can go for a skip here. Easy. Like this right here is a bit harder to correct your drifts right here. But that one wasn't that bad. It could have been better.
We're in third, we're doing decent. Okay, we can easily come back. <gasps> yes, I'm having fun. Streaming is fun, gaming is fun. <laughs> What's nice about games with computers is that there's no computer that has like a decent lead. Like everyone is fairly close together. <sighs> okay, I have no idea what that drift was. Oh, uh, okay, I swear on my life that my controller is busted to some capacity. Like my B button is really sticky. Um, I just need to farm more subs so I can buy a new controller, honestly. Any Oilers in chat? <laughs> Mod check? Oh my god, what, what am I doing? Oh no, I don't know if I can- Oh, uh, I literally- I literally can't- No! No, 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 no! <laughs> I swear, my controller is busted. I swear, that was an eighth. That was a bad- Take this L, that was bad. Oh, uh, all the courses that Rex are picking are just screwing me over. No, okay, I sh I show this every time anyone says I'm capping, but look, look, look at my controller. I have tape on it. There's literally tape on it. Cause like we tried to unscrew the bottoms to put a hard cover case on it, and it's not gonna screw back all the way in. So it's busted. I'm not capping. No, I don't rage. I didn't throw it. I literally just said we tried to unscrew and like put a new case on it, but it, we couldn't get the screws out. So like this part is kind of loose. So when I go like this, this part moves. So no, I did not throw it. I do not have anger issues. I did not have a heated gamer moment. Must be nice. <laughs> yeah, I have other stuff going on, just not anger issues. Let's put it at that. Oh, that was a perfect skip! Oh my god. I've never nailed that line as perfectly as I did right there. Just don't drop pencils, Rex. Easy. <laughs> okay. okay, we're in second. This is good. This is looking good. Oh, nailed the skip again. Have I finally learned what to do? Imagine. Okay, we just have to hold. Cross our fingers, no one hates us, and throw stuff at us. Uh, throw stuff at us. <laughs> I'm here to entertain you <laughs> and make fun of you. <laughs> this is my job. And in return, chat can make fun of me too. To an extent, just don't be mean. A little bit of trolling is fine. Oh no, oh no, no, no. Please, please, please hit him. Dude, that red shell saved us at the end.
Okay, another first on the board, and you know what that means. Yeah, <laughs> I'm just good at this game, Fairy. I'm not showing off. I'm just, like, in a really good mood today. Okay. So, since I got a gold trophy, doubters get fucked. I did get the gold. And you just lost out on your points. Because I pulled through and got that gold. Okay, let's start a new prediction. Or let's actually pick another pre first and then we'll do another one. Oh, look at how pretty she is. Doubters, frick you. Oh, it's a zero star. That's not good. But you know, still gold. Still gold. Okay. So, any suggestions for another character in another pre? <laughs> I honestly want to play as like Isabel or something. That'd be cool. Ghost? Okay, yeah. I don't know how heavy King Boo is. Okay, any pre. This one a lot. I like Lightning Cup a lot. Come on, pick Lightning, please. Do the hardest one. Special Cup is the hardest one, so we already did that. Stretch, guys. Let's see. Yeah, okay, let's do lightning. <laughs> okay, let's get another prediction going. Okay, so we're gonna do another will I get gold, yes or no. I'm gonna make the submission period longer because I forgot. Oops. So you guys got two minutes to predict. Any believers? Any doubters? I'm fairly decent at this cup, so I think I'll be able to get a gold this one. And remember, gold is overall, so pertaining to all four tracks for this pre. Okay, I like Boo. He's like a medium-sized character. Thank god. Oh my god, he's he's so much nicer to control when compared to the other ones. Oh my goodness. Oh, I did not mean to throw the green. I should have held. Okay, that line was pretty solid. <laughs> that one was not. Ooh, that one was so close. There's literally nothing I can do. Too bad I didn't get the banana literally two seconds sooner. Trying to go for the skip, but I flub. Oh, we got some believers! A shoutout! <laughs> I will pull through for my believers. I thought I did too early.
Dang it! Darn! Okay, so that's another second on the board. Oh, I did not realize this was chopped off. I'm sorry. Okay, so we got one more second. Okay, that should look a little bit better. Okay. But we can still get the gold overall. If I do well. <laughs> and I don't flub. It's always on the tracks that I think I'll do well at. That seem to trip me up. <clears throat> oh, that line is always so difficult. I missed the trick, rip. Sorry. No! Oh my god. I got no items. This sucks. I knew that was coming for you. I, I literally saw it coming. Okay, I'm, I'm only in fifth. We can come back. But I want to do the skip here. Like, just give me a boost. Model so small. Oh, give me just one, one little item. Come on. Come on, give me a speed boost. No, no, no. Huh. Dang it. <laughs> Another sub for you guys. Oops. <laughs> ah. Imagine me thinking I'm good at this game. Hey. Why am I flubbing my own favorite three? Huh. <sighs> Doubters might win. Because I got a second and then a fourth. Because mm. I have to get first overall. I think I'm just cracking under the pressure. Like, off stream, I'm really good at this game. <laughs> I swear. He nailed that turn. Back in first. Let's go.
god, I can't see! This line is always so hard, the one right here at the end. Especially when the track falls away. Not fun. <laughs> the little baby fell off. <laughs> you guys ever, like, find videos when people get hurt or, like, little babies, like, fall over and trip to be way too funny? help if we're tiny because it actually helps with the lines. There we go. I honestly thought that because this track is the hardest in the pre but I got a first so shout out to me man. <laughs> Start chanting for me to lose. I, I presume you were a doubter huh Rex? Yep, I see you got that pink prediction icon. I'm doing this for my believers. I am such a beast when it comes to this track. Like, I can for sure pull out that first. I can for sure do it. God, I almost fell off. Hey, believers, I'm doing this for you. No, no, no. Okay, I came back. I can still do it. Hey! Thank you for the raid, dude. Oh yeah, you're from Rainy's chat. Hey, thank you. Hi raiders. Um, doing some Mario Kart chant or what? Sorry, I have a command for raiders. I'm sorry. Let me let me do it. There we go. <clears throat> oh, okay, we still got that gold. We still got it. Believers, I did it for you. Okay, let's go ahead and and that prediction. Um, yeah, so readers do whatever you want. Just be nice, okay? <laughs> um, we're doing Mario Kart. Pretty self-explanatory. If I don't get first, I give chat subs. Capped at 10, because I'm not rich. Will Megan get gold? Yes, I got gold, so... Believers? There we go. Doubters get fricked. <laughs> um... <laughs> Did you delete my island? Yes, I did. I did. It, it took me a while to actually figure out how to actually delete the island, but I did it. So we basi did all the basics of deleting the islands. Like, we, we donated enough creatures to Nook to where Blathers will come tomorrow. So we got that set up. Okay, I gotta update our chart because we got one more first place because I clutched. Let's see, as of right now, I owe chat six subs, so we can maybe- We'll do one more pre- we'll do one more. That'll be guys, like I said, capped at ten, unless I totally flub this last pre and get last in all four races. So, any suggestions for my next character and my next pre? <clears throat> any suggestion, guys? I like light characters, so Isabel would be pretty cool. A 
and never played with like a baby character either. So maybe we can do a baby character. No, please don't choose heavy. Please, please. If you like me, if you like me, choose a light character. If you want me to win, choose a light character, guys. I almost put water everywhere. <laughs> Called Mario? Okay, we can do that. <laughs> Sucks for you, but Gold Mario is a medium weight character, so I know how to drive it. <laughs> okay. Any suggestions for pre? Let's see. If you guys don't want me to get first, I would choose this one. As you can see, I have a zero star trophy in this one, so that means... I've yet to get first in all four tracks, so maybe this one would be a good choice for last break. <laughs> okay, as of so far, we've done Special Cup, we've done Lightning Cup, and then we've done Shell Cup. You agree? Yeah, I think Egg Cup is pretty cool. Okay, we're gonna do egg cup. <laughs> no, no one's fighting Rex. Okay, let's get another prediction going. Okay, so same as last time. Will Megan get gold? Yes or no? Gold means overall first place between all four races. So, guys, get to predicting. Any believers? Doubters? Before you place your bets, I'm decent at this pre. I'm decent at it. The line was actually really good. We got some believers. We got 10 points of believers. Let's go. Save. Anybody generally do all the drifts for that one last section? It's so difficult because the tights are the turns are way too tight. <laughs> okay, we're in second, but <laughs> we can easily come back, even if I did not get any items there. Okay, I was breaking way too much, I'm sorry. Oh, we finally have more points and believe than doubt. Imagine. You guys actually believe me? Oh, see, it, it's so it's it's so difficult when you're in the middle of the pack because you're more likely to get hit by items or rammed. It's not fun. I know some people intentionally stay in the center that way they get better items, but I'm just like just stay in first because it's so hard to catch up most of the time. Okay, I, I do not want the drift there. Uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> oh my god, what is this? Literally, what is going on? I'm breaking way too much? My sister told me if my controller keeps messing up, I can borrow hers. So I think for next stream, I'll just use her controller. Because this is ridiculous. See, okay, I my B button was sticky. If I get 12, I'm, I'm literally gonna end stream. <laughs> Throwing, oh no. Oh, this is not good. This is really bad. I don't think you can come. <laughs> I don't think you can come back from a seventh and get first. I don't think you can do it. Okay, another sub for you guys. Frick, frick. Uh, I'm I'm sorry, believers. I don't I don't know if I can come back from this. Oh no. 
Dude, I'm so glad I have, like, access to, like, predictions and stuff. Because to me, predictions and gambas make the stream. Yes, I can. Oh, Downs, you're a believer. I see you're a believer. I, I will try. I will try my best. But to me, the funnest stream is watching people play Mario Kart and playing with predictions. It's literally so entertaining. First, I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> uh, not anymore. <laughs> Stream went for longer than I anticipated, and my sister just got home, so I have to be a bit more quiet. Oopsie. <laughs> I did not anticipate Stream going for this long. But you know, it's okay. It's okay, I'm having fun. But honestly, I did not think it would take me an hour and a half to do Animal Crossing. <laughs> Cause like, Animal Crossing is a game to which you can play like all day and it's pretty chill. Or rather, I can play it all day and be fine. <laughs> it, it's funny cause like, on the days where she sometimes stays home from work, she's like, you talk really loud! <laughs> it's because the way my mic is set up, it's about a foot away from me, because I don't like having stuff in my face. But I have to talk a bit louder for it to pick me up. cohesively. And the walls in my house are very thin. So if I talk too loud, everyone can hear me talking. <gasps> no! <sighs> it. Another sub for you guys. <laughs> Dang it. Yeah, I'm in fourth overall. It is still going to be difficult to get that gold. I can maybe get a silver, but that's not what we're looking for. Believers wanted gold, so. Sag. Can I get some Sages in chat, please? Like, just validate how sad I'm feeling right now. I, I I do know how to use metal war Wario. It's just y'all are distracting me. Now I understand why streamers ignore their chat. <laughs> well that line is actually beautiful. Oh, lines were lovely this lap. Oh my goodness. I think I placed up in another. Did I place up there? Just self sabotage. Okay, we have a decent lead. We are a solid turn ahead from the other players. So as long oh, there's there's a blue shell coming. I literally see it. There's notification, but I saw it on the map. And of course, right after I get hit by the blue, I get a boom box. Imagine. What are the odds? Okay. We're doing good. We, got, we have protection. We should be able to hold. Let's get rid of that protection, because honestly, I want more items. Got another banana. Doing good. Easy. Back in first, BB! Oh no, okay. 
Let's do the math. If I have third right now. Ugh. I, okay. Even if I get first in this last race, it might still... It's a toss-up. It can be either a first, second, or third, depending on how everyone else scores. So, maybe... Maybe... <laughs> maybe... I can get that gold. Okay, last race of the day. Last chance for gifted subs. Let's see after if I have to pay Twitch five more dollars. I used to think that gifting yourself subs would be an infinite money glitch, but if Twitch takes a portion of it, you're just losing money. <laughs> so... <laughs> yeah. I was not as excited. But he knows for content, so you know it's fun. I'm not saying I will do gifted subs for every single stream, because that would be insane. But it, it's fun to do occasionally. Leave it at that. I do not have a job, so... <laughs> I get chore money. I get 70 bucks a week, so... Maybe every once in a while we can do a gift in some stakes, but not every week. Okay, let's screw someone over. I know putting bananas in the mystery box is mean, but you know, I'm playing to win. I want to save that last five bucks. Okay. Protection, we're good. We're actually crushing. <laughs> we're crushing the stage. Show, come on. How is it not hit her yet? <gasps> Did you guys see that? She threw the banana right, perfect timing. <sighs> it's another sub for you guys. Good job, guys. You got me. Dang it. That's gonna be a silver trophy, not a gold. Darn. Man, I, I was I was really trying, believers. Even if I got... I think even if I got first, it would not have been enough points for a first overall. So. Doubters, good job. You got me. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and... Oh, it's pretty split that time. 56 versus 44. Not bad. Okay. I did not get gold. I'm sorry, believers. Doubters. Good one. Good job, guys. Um. Okay, I have to get the subs. One second. Okay. So, let's see. How many can we actually get? So we got second five times, fourth once. Oh, y'all, oh, you guys got the cap. <laughs> you guys get the ten gifted subs. Okay. So give me one second while I go do that. Un <clears throat> segundo. I will pay up. I'm not gonna scam. No scams here. Sag, fifty dollars. <laughs> Rip. G gift myself ten subs. Yeah, I'll do it. <laughs> Guys, I'm down bad. Hey, thank you for the gifted sub downs. Thank you. I'm I'm up five bucks. Let's go. <laughs> thank you. Um. Oh, you gifted Vora a sub. Cool. Vora will love that. Okay. Okay, it's processing, it's processing. There we go. For you guys. You guys get 10 subs, I promise. There we go, I lost 10 times, you get 10 subs. And there we go. Oh, let's see who got subs. Our mood got one. Princess Daisy got one, Baby Rosalina, they were in chat earlier. Dan got a sub, cool. Juicy Doodles got a sub. 
Cool, nice Sue. Okay. Um, I was gonna say one more thing, but I forgot. Okay. So that's basically all I got for today. I think it was a pretty fun stream. Um, we deleted our Animal Crossing Island live. No tears, thankfully. We <laughs> talked about emotes. <laughs> Um, now that there's been, like, gift subs dispersed and, like, people who subbed, who gave me your money, um, if you have any suggestions for potential emotes, like I said earlier, my goal is to have emotes made within a month, that way if you received a sub today, you will be able to use some emotes by the end of your first month. Thank you, Downs. Thank you. Um, so yeah, if you have any suggestions, you can always type in chat or whatever. Um, yeah, thank you to anyone who subscribed. I actually, um, for subs, I was going to write in a journal, so I'm gonna grab that real quick. Give me one second. Okay, I'm actually a dummy dumb and I lost the journal. So I will find it, but I will still write people's names down. Oh my god, I had the journal. I rearranged my room the other day and now I can't find it. So, oops. Okay. If y'all don't know, I'm kind of artsy, so I can do like a little bit of cal oh, calligraphy. Okay, let's see who's sub today. Okay. Maybe like Amaranth, write your name on my arm. Okay. I think it's interesting how people can put caps and like lowercase mixed in the user. Let's see, how do you draw a person chip? So we're doing J, F, Downs right now. Oh, that's not- that's not how you do the F. Oops. I'll write this nicer in the journal, I promise. I almost spelled it wrong, rip. One. I am GF Downs. Hey! Hi Steve! Bragas. Thank you. I have been working hard. Hey, it's nice to see you in chat. Okay, we're writing subs names down because I didn't do them earlier. Okay. Yes, yeah, still grinding around the Sigma grind set. And then also, Bra Fairy, we're gonna give her purple. <laughs> she gifted five subs and gave me her prime sub, so she's pretty cool. I wish I could do a POV cam, but honestly, I do not want to move my camera. Because I hate having to move my camera and then put it in the same position the next day. And where like the slight where like the camera is slightly off from what where it was before, it's aggravating to me. draw a cursive eye? Isn't it kind of crazy how they don't teach cursive in school anymore? It's wild to me. 
I spelled her name wrong. I spelled her. I put. <laughs> I put brush fairy. I will write it correctly in the journal for you, fairy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I promise you, I will do it correctly. I lost my journal. I am a mess today. Oopsie. Okay, so she did times five and her primer. Okay, and then we had a sub from Austin Attack. That is such a cool name. That has like vibes of what a little five year old would call their superhero. Just saying. I'm not being mean, I'm just saying that it's a very fun user. I need to get a POV cam for real. When I first started streaming, I did art stuff. And that was because I my computer was nowhere near good enough for like gaming. <laughs> How's the moon jar going? It's going alright. I basically put Odyssey on pause because I was getting frustrated with Darker Side. So I decided I will grind and practice Darker Side off stream a bit. And then come back to it because I don't want to get too mad on stream. Because even though that is good content, that is not me. So I will come back to the Odyssey jar. I think we have like 700 moons overall. But she's on pause for now. I'm thinking of another potential speed run to do. Okay. Then we had Austin Attack 12. That is cool. Yeah, this is my first affiliate stream. That's why it's a bit sus today. Okay, he was a primer sub. Then we had Kate Subscribe. I need to get faster at this. This is my first stream. I will get faster at writing names, I promise. I will practice my calligraphy off screen so I get faster. <laughs> I think it's so satisfying to watch calligraphy videos on like Instagram or TikTok. I think because it's just so fun to like admire people's skills. I know those type of videos pop off on Facebook. Okay, then we had... Eight Zade. Give me a tier 1 sub. Pretty pog. Oh, and then Downs had a gifter as well. Cool. That's all the subbies I got today. I will put them in a more formal journal next time. I'll have that ready for tomorrow, probably. Um, yeah. So, thank you to anybody who came in to stream today. Thank you to any lurkers, any chatters. I appreciate everyone. Um. <laughs> you gotta give me a sub, Rex. Gifted don't count. It don't count. <laughs> but I feel it. You're broke like me, so I understand. Um, anyway, yeah, thank you to anybody who came in. I appreciate everyone who helped me get to this point. Also, thank you, dude, for the raid earlier. Thank you. <laughs> um, yeah, I think that's all I have for today. Thank you to anyone who was here for, like, majority of the stream. That was, like... Definitely one of my longer streams today. I did not anticipate I would go for this long, but yeah, I think that's so. all. Probably gonna stick with the 3D schedule. So Stardew Valley tomorrow, and then Mario Kart on Thursday, and no, Wednesday and Thursday. So yeah, we're not gonna raid today because I don't know people yet. Once I get friends, I will start raiding and stuff. I hope everyone has a great day, and thank you for spending some time with me today. Okay, oh, also, before I go, we can do exclamation socials to see all my other offline links. And also check out my YouTube channel, I have a new video out. Hopefully going to be working on new videos this week as well. And also, you can check out 
my clips accounts to where you can see like highlights or clips from stream. So check it out if you want to. If not, that's okay. <laughs> I don't care. Um, <laughs> yeah. Thank you to any new follows, any gifters, any subbies today. Okay, I'm gonna say bye now. I need to go eat lunch. Okay, bye guys.